I haven't even gone over the Moogle. Let's do that right now. Let's do that right now. How about that? Fast travel to Bill's ranch. Let's go do the Moogle thing. There's just a ridiculous amount of stuff to do. And the crazy part is that it's pretty rewarding. It's not that it's like bad and just filling up space and time. No, it's uh, it shockingly is leading to pretty good rewards. So that's where I'm like, yeah, I don't feel like burned out on the grasslands yet because I am still getting good stuff. And to be frank, I have it on dynamic difficulty, so I feel like that might be a contributing factor. Oh, there was this thing also that I got to. Item transmuter. Check this out. The windmill gear. A key component of windmills erected for the Republic. This is like a quest item. Look at it, it's a key item. And I have to kill a quest to which is most likely, don't answer this, which is most likely a... Um, uh, uh, one of one of the rare monsters that pops up around here. So I'm like, oh, so this does something related to the big windmill stuff that I have to go find. So that I really want to do. Further? Most mostly rubies and emeralds, right? What? Play arts rest spot. What is that? What is that? Collector's item, a model of the benches that serve as a place of respite. Wait, what? It's a key item? Huh? It's a toy? Are we Shenmuing now? Is this shit literally Shenmu? Shit! Play arts. Yeah, funny. Liter like also the guys that make like 135th soldier stuff. Yeah, we actually we did this in the old game. <laughs> God damn. Foof. We actually did this stuff in the old game. No kidding. Play arts. Hilarious. Hilarious square. Bunnies everywhere. All right, Choco time. Uh, I'm sorry, Moogle time. Mog. Here we go. Uh, make sure I got this thing set up correctly. Okay. Mog. Mog. Um. Mog. I'm going in. Smells like reefer smoke and butt hash around here. What the? Told you. Welcome to our Moogle Emporium. I'm sorry to say, we aren't open quite yet, and I'm not even sure when we will be. <laughs> Told you. Those Mooglets are refusing to come back, and we can't do business without them, Kubo. Actually, maybe you wouldn't mind helping? The Mooglets are having too much fun. Kubo's sure are weird. Own, so I want you to round them up. And then we can open up the Emporium, and everyone will be happy, Kubo! Uh, <laughs> fine. I'll see what I can do. Thanks so much, Kubo! Fine. Yeah, I'll help you. Over here, you weird chickens. Don't shoot at me. Get in there. No! Get in there! One down. Get in there. I said get in there. Two down. Oh god! Can those explode already? You. God. 
No, don't you dare. There we go. <laughs> this edible ain't shit. Whoa. <laughs> Think. Thanks so much, Koopo. Now we can finally open the Emporium. Here you can exchange Moogle medals for cool stuff we found lying around. Everything's great. I promise. Uh huh. Crazy thing in my head. Returning all the Mooglets to their mocks will grant access to new shop at which you can exchange Mog medals. Um. Ruby and Emerald. Wow. Cute game. Uh, I have 11 Mog Medals, and this is all... Damn, 30% HP up on earrings? Dog. Uh, Sword of Arts. All right, I, I need to get these. Oh, I, I'm getting one or the other, apparently. Increases Cloud's skill points. Increases Tifa's skill points. Crap, I need another Mog Medal. I'll get one soon. So. Just so you know, there are six more mock stools out there, Koopo. So be sure to say hi to my friends if you find one. Also, the more emporiums we open up, the more stuff we'll have for you to buy. Uh -huh. That's a win-win situation in my books, Koopo. Uh-huh. You weird chicken. Weird chicken was talking to me. <laughs> um, Koopo. all right, Koopo. Now... Do I probably don't even need to use the sword art thing? It probably just gives me gives it to me straight up, right? It was just worth 10 SP. Let's find out. Key items. These are consumables. Um let's find out. Transmuter chip, materials. The art of sword play. Uh yeah, okay. So I just have it, right? I just have it now. Okay. Yeah, now Cloud has 10 more. Gotcha. Does that mean... Um, I hit level 3. Does that mean I get some new weapon skill? It does. Replenish ATB when using a weapon ability? It does. Um... I like my ATB recharge rate though. Dude, I legit need more weapon skill slots. Right now I have to choose one, so I'm just talking to myself. I don't want to know. Uh, okay. <laughs> Over here. Anything interesting catch your eye, Koopa? And I have five left. Okay. Come again <laughs> soon. All right. What are you? What's this thing? Koopa? No, I don't want to do it again. No, God, don't send me back. Rounding up all the for me? I would mind. In fact, I would mind. In fact, I, I mind and I want to get, I want out. Let me out of this absolute hellscape. Let me get a better time. I didn't see anything. All right, flashbang me out of here, Mooglet. Get me the hell out of here. Over here. What is that? Oh, we got items. Yo, we got items? So area of interest, meaning that there's several things over here we can do. Am I gonna do all the side quests? I'm just gonna do side quests until they're uninteresting. Pretty much that that's my that's my take right now. I am not over the grasslands. I, I ain't over the grasslands yet. So, I'm just gonna keep doing this until I feel the need that I really wanna move on. And right now I'm enjoying it. I just got a Moogle medal as well. So I can cash that in.
Right now, all the all this content has been relatively interesting, and all the extra stuff has been fun. So I am digging it, and the game is like shoving new things in our face. Now the Mog thing, right? And I have only done like two or three hunts. That's it. Loud ass thing. Super loud. All right, better. Man. Oh, man. Man, oh, man. Okay. We might be a little strong. Yo, Zio Maylin, thank you for the five gift subs. And Professor of Water, thank you for the bits, dude. Um. Okay. Stream looks better. Did you change something? Yes. I did. Uh, does it look better than yesterday? Uh, do things actually look better than yesterday? I changed a few values in the X24 encoder to better handle grass. I'm not kidding. We're not on performance. This is, uh... Well, the YouTube... For anybody that was like, oh, the quality wasn't as good yesterday, um, the... YouTube video is in 4K. So if you want to watch like, oh, like essentially lossless looking footage, uh, the YouTube video is in 4K. However, I also got a, a hand on the encoder to better handle grass. So the grass area should look a little bit better on 1080p. Again, it's just managing the things I know with what I can do Thanks for coming to with the bitrate. Um, Way of the Fist. Nice. I want those HP up earrings, dude. We gotta find more Mog Did Metals. Did you find anything you like, Koopo? Over here! The encoder decided to touch grass. Yeah, I just changed a few values. I saw it and I, I felt the same way. I'm like, this looks okay, but I can make it look better. Yo, J6, thank you. When Remake first came out, it managed to blow your mind. I didn't think that they could accomplish this feeling again, but they did it. It's crazy. It took me 10 hours just to do the grasslands. Yeah, man. I'm with you. I'm getting- I get goosebumps just running around this place. I have a chocobo, I just haven't gotten on it. I like running around, man. Sometimes I just like running around. And I really dig that you don't need to slow down for your chocobo. It runs up to you and you just run close to it and you're on it. Oh, also, chocobos can open boxes. They can open up the the signs as well. Found that out when I was like testing the settings last night. I was like, wait a minute. I can open up. I can do everything from the back of a chocobo still. Uh-oh. Uh, scent. Why, yeah, and this is why we should be on, on chocobo back, right? This is the reason. I miss all this stuff. Oh, yeah, I'll take a thousand bucks just buried in the ground. Uh, yeah, cool. Yeah, cool. I'm cool with that. Uh-oh. The music and the terrain changed. Oh, funny. You sure you want to fight? Here we go. Together. Again. Damn. By the time I switch over to Tifa, these enemies are toast. The dynamic difficulty is certainly working, but it is, uh... You know what? It is working. You know why? I watch other people playing, and enemies are dying mad fast. I was like, wow. Uh, they're dying really quick. Quicker than I was expecting. Yeah, enemies are getting cooked. And especially in the flashback, I was watching people playing the flashback on normal, and dude, enemies were dying in like a couple hits. I was like, what? No, dude, like the... Those mobs were surviving. I actually got to do some moves against them. It felt quite nice. What is this? Get out of here! I didn't even get a chance to scan it. 
Died too quick. Sorry. What the hell is that beginning mission? I'm so into this game right now. The first, even calm, is amazing. The first couple hours of this game are wild. Like, wild. Kind of like, whoa, dude, what are we in for here? What is going on? I don't think I can get up there. Okay, running around. Yeah, the Zack intro is actually like, to be real, it's it's not too much of a spoiler, but I put up my first video and like the, the title is, uh, it's been five minutes and I'm losing my mind. <laughs> it's been five minutes and what the holy shit is happening? I should be on Joke about here. Yeah, Calm was wonderful, dude. I have not I have not run around a town in a game in so long that felt as lovely as Calm. It was so good. I just wanted to hear what every NPC had to say. I just wanted to go check everything out. And then you got to buy stuff. There was things to unlock. I was I played all the damn card games with everybody. I, I stole all their cards. Um it was legit. Felt like Disneyland. Felt like Disney World over there. I loved it. Crybaby Ned. Jesus. Hilarious characters, dude. The creepy girl that talks through her, like, puppet, and then she's completely normal when she doesn't. She sounds like she's possessed. Crybaby Ned was the, uh, the highlight of Calm. Nobody beats a crybaby. Okay. Uh, I did this fight in the first time I played this experience like a month ago. This fight whooped my ass. Dangerous fiends may be in the vicinity. Exercise caution. These alpha dunks whoop alpha my dunk ass. Identified. Commencing guidance protocol. The docile disposition of the alpha dunk led to its widespread adoption as a beast of burden. Applications included agriculture, transportation, and even warfare. Variants like these, however, were valued as a source of hides and tusks used for arts and crafts. Unfortunately, they are a notoriously difficult creature to raise in captivity. Yeah, no kidding. And were usurped by the now ubiquitous Chocobo. Okay. At present, the only remaining wild alpha ducks can be There's like a pile of tanks up there. Look at that. Most are aggressive. All right, so priority number one. We must study them thoroughly before they become a threat to both animals and humans. Priority number one. Ass ass the elephant. Yeah, chill, 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 chill. Getting a sneak attack. Okay. Abilities. Ass ass. So do we know anything about enemy skill in here? Uh, a rare alpha dunk variant that bears deep the grudge towards humans after losing its family to overhunting. Uh, consequently, it will lash out at any person it sees. Exploiting its elemental weakness will pressure it, but also cause it to see red, which at one which at which point it will strengthen its guard and begin counterattacking. As time passes, others nearby will also begin to rampage. Time to finish the job. <laughs> Jeez. Uh, fire and ice. Here we go. Take the lead. Let's go over here. Aerith, are you doing okay? My god. This ends here. Wow! What a fight! Here it comes. Victory is on the Don't stop now. No more games. Is Aerith okay? I'll show you what I can do. Uh oh. Barret's doing stuff over there. Um, spells. They got arrow. I want to use this some more, dude. Hold on. 
and abilities Chrono Ages. Work? It didn't work! Oh my god, it's whooping my ass. Let's go! <laughs> Let's go. Synchro Cyclone. Game's fucking amazing! Game's fucking amazing! Gotcha. Deal with that. This game's fucking amazing! <laughs> Tag combo. Yeah, it looks like it's too big to uh to have it stop in, in the, the ward. The ward might be for small enemies only. That was a very impressive battle just now. Well done! Based on the battle data you provided, I was able to generate a new virtual combat trial. Oh, and I help too. Feel free to try it whenever the mood takes you. Go on! Cool. Cool. Very cool. Um, yeah, I don't want to. I don't know if I want to leave the grasslands until we get Titan. Until we're able to beat Titan. And apparently, I was looking at it again. If you get all of the information, it doesn't just lower Titan's like uh, strength for the fight. It makes him stronger when you get him. It like gives abilities to Titan. Like, check this out. Let's see if I can find it. It's in um, Chadley or Intel. Yeah, so check this out. Allows you to summon Titan to aid you in battle. That's the default. But if you do more stuff in the field, you get summon level one, summon level again, and boulder hurl. You get a new move. So the more you engage the environment, that actually makes the, the summon material like you more. So they work harder. That's smart. So many good calls, <laughs> right? I still don't exactly know how enemy skill works, though. I won't lie. I have to. I'll have to, I'll have to do more stuff with it. I'll have to more ass ass more dickheads. Ooh, can we go down there? Or is this place all inaccess in inaccessible? The music's different over here. Right? Dude. The music is different over here. Huh? It's totally- it's- it's the same theme, but it's different. Yeah, instead of the orchestral stuff, it's like a trumpet. Huh. Yeah, different spots have different versions of themes. Game just doesn't stop, dude. Oh, as you get more world intel, the music changes? No way. No way. You know what? I was watching Simmons play, and he did have one criticism that I think there's a pretty easy solution for. Uh, you get all of this stuff that you can do, right, with Chadley, but it all boils down to the combat simulator. Here's a, here's something I hope they change for later, if not maybe in the next game. Combat si simulator always looks like the combat simulator, right? Like it looks like a, a fighting game training stage. It would be cool if depending on the combat sim engagements you have, if it had like a mocked version of that environment, like a VR space of that environment, so it's just like a flat VR grasslands. Not super dense, but just like, hey, you know, if you're doing grassland style fights, you get a, a visual looking grasslands with just like maybe just the crazy training stuff in the background. Yeah, I think that would be really cool. I think Crisis Square does something kind of similar too. It doesn't need to be all, you know, geometrical like this is. Or I'm sorry, all this topography. Just needs to look a little bit different. 
how to point it. There we go. This needs to look a little bit different. Yeah. That might be a game three thing, you know? It's one of my, I think, it's not really even a gripe, to be honest, because I, I dig the battle arena. I think it looks cool. It at least has some visual difference right now when everything you see in the game is this. Everything's all this beautiful background and shit. Um, all right. Can't go up there. At least I don't think. Where should I be headed? That's towards objective. This has a fight over here. It's fast travel. Wow, fast travel is insanely fast. Holy hell. Wow. How is fast travel faster than the combat simulator? What the heck? Yeah, I have to start focusing on the Beck missions as well. Very nice. Oh. They're like psycho squirrels. Psycho squirrels. Huge ass rock. Keep it together. Holy mother of God! Holy God! Pressure both fire and ice imbued enemies. Whoa. I didn't. I also didn't ask them. I got so absorbed into whooping their butts. Sorry. Sorry. I got so absorbed. And there's zero reason for me to look at the chat when I'm absorbed. Okay. Ah, oh, I got nuked. Um, weakness. Okay. So, uh, exploiting its elemental weakness or hitting it with powerful attacks will make it flinch. So this one's weakness is fire. Cloud, can you work with me here? Oh, there's no targets. They're just being crazy.
We got fire as well. Barrett, tell me you have ice. Dang it! Ah, man. Okay, I need to put ice materia. Hold on a second. I need ice materia. Tifa had ice. Yeah, we got to go back to her. Yeah, okay. Cloud Aerith Tifa. Probably go Cloud Red Tifa. Okay. Nice, that's changed from the other game. Come on. It's on you. All set. Need a target here. He ran away! We got all the objectives. Where are you at? There you go. That's too Deal with that. Wow, once you get their element, they're dead. They are dead. Nice. So that goes towards party XP if you get all the objectives done. Nice. Okay. Um. Yeah, I know. Killer Instinct got a patch. Dragon Ball got a patch. Tekken just got a patch. Ed came out in Street Fighter 6. Um. John Cena is arguably one of the most fun characters in Mortal Kombat 1. Everybody hates me. Everybody hates me. I don't know what I did. I don't know what I did to all these devs. They hate me. I must have pissed them off so much. They hate me. Um... Let's go down here. They hate me. Here comes the Bloodborne remake. Gonna tent it up. Sorry, cushion it up. Who's Bort? Huh? Who's Bort? Oh no, not the Bloodborne remake. Exactly. Exactly, right? Um, item transmitter, how many cushions do I have? Oh, I have like 11. Dude, I got a lot. Anything else I can make that's valuable? Planet's Favor. Copper Bracer gives me 30 XP. Um, eh. Why not? Enhanced Copper Bracer, 5 XP. Costs almost nothing. Might as well. 40 XP for power wrist guards. Um, yeah, that'll level me up. Do it. I'll take the level. So, I'm now craftsmanship six. The guiling armlet. Oh no. Oh no, I can make these things now. Oh no. Can I make high potions? I still don't have the stuff for it. Um, mist high potion requires weird stuff. The gold needle. I still gotta find a quest to Kotal. Okay. Let's head over here. Alpha Dunk's chill. You don't normally aggro.
Music change? Get alpha dunked. Uh oh. Smell it up. I like that you have to point in the direction, it doesn't do it for you automatically. Ether onion? Huh? What the hell's an ether onion? We got a side quest around here somewhere, right? Uh, I'll go unlock... Wait, it's down here. Right behind us. Funny. They turned it into a mini game. Don't be an idiot. I had to for the treasure. Obviously. I was inconsolable. Inconsolable? What's that? Oh, it's like when you're consolable, but not. I'm running on empty. Come after us? This is my uh the stuff I'm the best at is stealth. Okay. We'll hide out here. Better be an up too. Hey boss. Can we eat yet? I'm hungry. It ain't ready yet, dingus. This guy gotta turn around or what? Well done, what gotta get done? Well, not poorly. Yeah, but I think you got it done. Ah. Oh, 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 oh. Hey, are you a chef? You got a puppy hat! If that's not well done, I don't know what is. Presenting the finest who you'll ever be. Prince Dragon Bird! You're the best, boss! <laughs> Turned out pretty good if I do say so I'll just eat this through my mask. Ignore all the people inside this this room. Oh, I see yellow. What the heck is it? Then why the hell are you chasing us? Work. Really? You know you could just tell us who you're working for. Cut out the middleman. Deal with them direct. I don't have time for this. Just a word now, boss. Relax, boys. I've got just the plan. I call it bait in the hook. Yeah, hook in the bait. So, uh, what's the bait? 
For all intensive purposes, it's you. <laughs> intensive. Here, take this. Thanks. Can I eat it? <laughs> Tuck it for the getcha! Butch beefed up. Take the lead. Oh dear. They died incredibly fast. ate a turkey leg and got mad buffed out. Ah, okay, good. It's on the way to a tower. So, at least get something. Oh, I forgot to ass ass him. You're definitely right. I did forget to ass ass him. Ask, ask him a question. He's about to aggro us. It's just some orcs and some squirrels. Typical stuff. Just an emerald sitting on the ground. Don't worry about it. That it? That's gotta be it. More emeralds. Dude. There we go. Oh, there's dogs all over it. And a bird. Here we go. Music, dog. Allow me. Perfect parry into go to hell. Oh, the sometimes these things aren't on the bottom floor, they're like all the way up here. Yeah, isn't it great? The music choice here is so cool. It's hollow. Yeah. From the first game. What we got around here? Oh, there's places to go over there? Okay. Alright. I'm gonna have to go back to Chadley to get some materia soon. We're already uh, halfway done to the through the grasslands. Hey, you? Where'd my chocobo go? Here, bird. Hey, you.
Ghost of Tsushima foxes. Huh. Getting dark. Oh. Life spring. That's a lot of stuff. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. Yeah, the music. I love the music during the Life Springs. It's so cool. Okay. What are we looking at? What is this? Divine Intel? I'll just go check that out. Found it. According to local legends, Titan possesses earth-shattering strength. He is capable of crushing whole mountains with his fists. Perhaps we have him to thank for the rolling hills and verdant plains that comprise this region of the planet. Nice. More stuff for Titan. Give me the mini game. Got it. Good enough? Cool. Pretty close to getting Titan now. Yeah, the Titan music. I think that's the music that plays when you fight him, too. We, try, we tried it once. Kick these boxes around. Um, yeah, I think we got everything. Approximately. Uh-oh. Emerald. Ch chicken's not designed for this. Anything hanging out over here? Besides these rubies? The heck is up there? Wow, that looks like a cave. Weird. We can't get up there. Weird. Chocobo stuck on things. This is why you want to be on a chicken. 
when you're when you're just walking around. This is why. All the extra loot. Mostly rubies and emeralds. Right? Is what I've noticed. What in the hell is this? Huh? Grasslands port. Huh? Huh. Well, how about that? Well, how about that? Triple strike materia. Item master. Not terrible, to be real. Do I have any extra slots or anything? Um, oh my god, Cloud. I can actually give you something else. Oh, Tifa does have an extra slot. What happened here? That's weird. Yep, Ice Tifa. Do you have, uh... Let's give you... Either item master... Um... Give you lightning. Barrett could also use um, something better. Just realize. Uh, yeah. Yeah. These are good. Need to be using these. Hunter's Bangle. Poison and fire. Let's give you ice as well, red. Um, Barret needs... Leather, bangle, no, no, no. The enhanced copper. Lightning, HP up, auto unique. How about we give you... Item master. Yeah. Now I gotta do something about clink. Right? Uh, leather bangle is just better. Right? I just realized I still have, like, the most basic thing with Cloud. I can probably make a different bangle. Uh, let's do... Do it. Just do it. Can't make these. I can't make another wood sprite. I need mellow oak. But I can make a copper bracer. And at this point, it's like, why the hell not? And I can enhance it. Cool. That's sick, dude. Um. Our wrist guards, earrings, or pinion, or charm, crescent moon charm. Yeah, I mean, what was I thinking? What in the hell was I thinking? So I had fire. Uh, we can also put either wind or another healing materia. I'll take another healing materia. Let's do that. Sick. Well, this is a new place. This is a new thing. Huh. Oh, cool. Jeez, man, when you leave caves, it looks incredible. Like, some of the lighting in the game is kind of goofy. But, man, when you, like, leave uh, to a, a bright area, it looks so sick. So that's over there. Uh, let's do this. Fiend intel. Ah, it's too much! Turn it off! Oh, Jesus! Uh-oh. Avoid Shinra's checkpoint. Yeah, we should. Seems like a good idea. Let me have some crazy bird over here or something. It's to my right. Some crazy burb? 
Uh, some crazy dog. We're in monster territory now. Uh oh. Rare grasslands wolf variant identified. Commencing. That's gonna be a fire dog. See the way that its mane stands on end? The electricity coursing through its body and keeping its hair upright is the product of over Wind. Right? Also contributed to a significant increase in aggression, Wind. agility, and speed. In fact, eyewitnesses report that it is capable of catching prey with lightning quickness. Oh, there's two of them. Joy. Habits, we too will be able to develop swifter, yeah, I'll assess it and then I'm gonna now use wind or poison or something. That was close. I got you. So, absorbed elements, lightning, no weaknesses. Rare grasslands, wolf variants caused through leaks in the pipeline, electricity courses through their bodies lend them to uh, more effectively stun, inflicting detrimental status effects and then will pressure them. Okay. So poison. Keep it together. Oh my god. Dude, Tifa is zipping! Jesus! Ow. Okay. Let's do this. Deal with that. Aerith, why can I you? Oh my god damn, brother. Uh, I'll just do this. It's on you. Aerith has arrow and cure. Who had poison? Somebody had poison. Okay. Somebody had poison. They're probably like red 13. Oh, I have to pressure the enemy. Crap. Um, what allowed them to be pressured again? Elemental weakness, most likely. Cloud. Cloud. I see that you completed that challenge with grace and panache. Don't you know it's rude to interrupt? Why? I didn't know such thing. <sighs> In any case, Cloud, gotta do a status I ailment. The battle data you sent and constructed a new virtual combat trial. Of course, you did, Chadley. Thank you. Um, maybe I don't have to switch the party, and maybe I have. Hold on a second. Items. I can't see it from there. Uh, well, let's just switch parties. Simple enough. Cloud Red Aerith. Hey, chicken, chill. Chicken, you might want to get out of here. Trust me. I know Jesus. God. So, Cloud, you need an SS? You do. Let's assess first. Cool. And now Aerith, 
I got to get you to get some ATB. Good lord. The red has the ATB. Bio. This guy. Stop pressure. There we go. Works out. That works out. Um. There we go. Decided not to multi-use. I refuse. Uh, these guys are right over here. Chicken. Get chicken. That a choco stop? It is. Yeah, I didn't know you could do this. Hey, chicken. You can fix these by just like staying on the chicken. These guys. <laughs> Gentlemen, I'm back. Interrupting your rave. What you do with the hideout key? <laughs> Buried it underground so nobody can find it. You idiot. What if some fun for nothing thugs break in and we get locked out? <laughs> Where did you come from? Save everyone the trouble and hand it over. Nothing trouble. Anything but that. Just do what he says, boss. Ooh, I've still got a trick up my sleeve. A trick I like to call diversionary tactics. <laughs> okay, you know what to do. <laughs> I bet you couldn't guess who's got it, even if you tried. Me? Uh, I... You see? The correct answer is... <laughs> Me, me, me! Look at these chumps! Our tactics got them totally diverted! <laughs> so, uh, what do we do now, boss? Isn't it obvious? We make a run for it! Wait a sec, boss! What about the game? He ain't going nowhere! Who are these guys? Who are all these bozos? Oh god. By the time I switched characters, they all died. I suppose you'll have our off days. I want them to get away. That's the plan. Once they lead us to their hideouts, then we hit them. I'm sorry to have ever doubted you. Before you receive your hunt, however, I'll need you to unearth this eBay berry. It shouldn't be too tough if you have a chocobo. I don't have a chocobo. That's impossible, Chadwick. Gotcha. Chicken, please. Chicken? What? Chicken, are you drunk? Oh. Oh. 
What in the hell is going on? Chicken not drunk. Down to dig, okay. All right. Looks like you found the key. Great. And in other news, the bandits have stopped running. Let's hope that the fourth time will be the proverbial charm. Yeah. This quest is, this just keeps going. They're back there. Oh, oh, they're back there. That's where that is. I'm gonna grab this tower. They're all the way back in that one gate that we found at the very start. I was like, what the hell is this for? Cloud, triple slash that ass. These fights aren't scaling, man. Enemies are dying really hard now. Oh, there's more stuff down here to do. I thought we were done. Yeah, we're on dynamic. Pretty. Making me climb for these Moogle charms, ain't ya? Yeah, here, hold on a second. We're on dynamic. We certainly are. The problem is, is that I'm like utilizing all of the game's mechanics, right? I'm not exactly effectively, but I'm using them. So things start dying. What's this? Helpful. Okay. Um. Number five. We're almost done with uh, all the fiend stuff. I'm still engaged enough to want to keep going. The music and the visuals are definitely helping, though. Right? Hey, hey. Oh, God. Chicken. Oh, jeez. Chicken. Although I do need to order a pizza. Whole family wants pizza, and I'm like, I want pizza, too. Picky eater. Dangerous fiends may be in the vicinity. Exercise caution. Rare yeah. Levricon variant identified. Levricon. Commencing guidance protocol. Observe its prodigiously powerful appendages. These impressive legs not only allow it to run down... Pressure, the stagger, and defeat all enemies within time limit. Okay. I'll read what the pressure is. Force. Oh good. Favorite snack. Oh god. Whether this qualifies it as a true gourmet or merely a picky eater is still a matter of contention. Whatever the case may be, further research could help turns you into a frog and eats you. Diet sustains its physique. So get in there and give it a good beating. Without being KO'd, of course. Turns you into a frog and then eats you. I believe in you. <laughs> Now. 
Ow. I'm gonna have to dodge right after this. Weakness is fire and ice. Um, exploiting its elemental weakness will pressure it. Frontal attacks will be ineffective while it's holding a rock. Oh my god, it's Uluyaku. Jesus. Jesus, god damn. Aerith is over here just getting her ass kicked. And she's been turned into a frog. Wonderful. Shit. Do I have a maiden's kiss? I don't. Oh my god, Cloud is actually dead. I can't hit him. He's dodging everything. He's dodging everything. Got all the objectives though, just in time. Way to go. All right. Level scaling seems to be working. Dynamic kicking in. Birds were pissed. Bravo! That was an extraordinary display. The data you collected will prove invaluable. In fact, we've already used it to produce a new combat trial. Of course. What? I see that my has already covered everything. Which means I have nothing to add at this time. <laughs> I like that uh, Chadley's getting pissed off at somebody else because he's starting to experience what we all experience. Chadley, she's just doing what you do, man. It's just the nature of things. Effin' Chadley. Yeah, Burb, take me to this. Uh... Let us partake of the planet's wisdom. Cool. The bird needs to chill out, though. Bird, chill. You're making me nervous. Bird, you're making me nervous. Chill. Whatever you're, whatever you've been eating, stop eating it. Oh my God, we're getting there. Wow, we're actually getting there. Cloud. That data has revealed an intriguing sight. The nest of the Quetzal Quattle, a rare bird native to these lands. So rare fact, that few have ever seen it. This is a prime research opportunity for us. Okay, cool. We found the Quetzalcoatl. The Quetzalcoatl? <laughs> the Quetzalcoatl?
Hold on a sec, chat. I'm ordering pizza. Oh, dear God. Oh, dear God. <laughs> I wonder what this is. I'm ordering pizza. Sorry, chat, we're debating pizza. <laughs> Chat's saying I got cooties. <laughs> um, I'll go. Chad, I might have to open something. I might have to open something. Isn't this music wonderful. Um, what else do we have to do around this area? Oh, new battle. The quest to Kotal. <laughs> Can't make that jump chicken? Chicken? That was the collector's edition statue. Yes, that was the collector's edition version. We just popped it open. Hey, look at all this machinery. It's like a tiny reactor up here or something. I gotta go around. Mako Pipeline Maintenance Warehouse. Huh. Yo, what's up, Amaro? Welcome back. Where are we going? Oh, no. Once a specific number of life springs have been surveyed, a location of an especially powerful fiend will be revealed. Hold triangle to lure out the fl the whoa. Cloud, you have arrived in the lair of the majestic Quetzal Court. Make certain you're prepared before attempting to challenge it. So if you if you do enough stuff in a region, you get access to buffer fights as well. That's pretty sick. Um, yeah, we'll just try it. We have to assess it. Is everybody healed up? I think so. Might as well save. Might as well just make a save right here. You can't run. Yeah. Cool. Glad we did this, man. Yeah. Oh, God. Jesus. Best you with rank. 
Uh, it's about to whoop my ass. Its weakness is ice. No. Go on. Okay. Abilities, Arcane Ward. Crazy. Let's do stance. I'll take it. I'll take it. He's back. Uh, let's give 350 to everybody. Go for it. Hang back. <laughs> Did I assess it? I didn't. I got you. Um, inflicting enough damage by exploding its elemental weakness will pressure it as weak against ice. Each time it moves between the air and the ground, it will unleash a powerful attack. God. Let him have it. With me. Ascension, let's go. Nothing personal. Let's finish this. One more shot. Keep it up. Right, my turn. This one's for you. I actually need a uh, a friggin' Come on, team. Leave the rest to me. Oh no! Get up, Efret, let's go! The classic. Ready? 
taken over. Yeah, let's heal Aerith. Keep it together. This game is sick. <laughs> this game is sick. Confirmed. Pencil Quaddle defeated. Amazing work as always, Cloud. Your heroic victory over that vicious creature was a feast for the eyes. I suppose it falls to me to make my presence more tolerable. How do you? I <laughs> turned down now her then, volume. Allow me to congratulate you. <laughs> he turned on your down her volume. Beast, and thank you for the valuable biological data. You were likewise able to obtain something of great import. The beast's talent. I suspect that it can be used in the creation of something astounding. Yeah, Simmons, did you see how you unlock these fights? You just have to do stuff. <laughs> That's it. You just do stuff. And eventually they're like, hey, there's this crazy thing over here. Wow. Um, let me go back and look at the data of the enemy. Hold on a second. Giga Chudley. Uh, enemy intel. Questacodal. Rare stealable drops. Uh, uh, it all drops a Talon. It, uh, oh my God. It's morphable. What the hell? It's morphable? Battle log, assessed, staggered, limit break, landed, defeated one. Damn, man, the character models. Um, I don't think I actually finished the bandit quest line. Not yet. Not yet. About to. This thing is crazy looking. Well, that was fun as shit. That was fun as shit, dude. And, uh... The last bandit mission is... In fact, I think we're good on this whole area. To be real. I think that's about it. We got to go back to, to uh, obviously go back to here, but, you know, I think we're actually kind of good there. I wonder if you, I wonder if you repeat those fights. Damn, that was fast. I wonder if you do repeat those fights, if they are giving you experience and stuff like that. Oh, I can now make this. Yeah. Hold up. So the whole point of, of that fight is that it unlocks this. The windmill gear, which is a quest item. I think it gets the windmills working. Key component of the windmills erected by the public of Junon. Um, inventory. Uh, key items, maybe? Yeah. Yeah. I don't know if we learned anything else about it from here. You can, like, craft key items. It's kind of sick. I'll have to go back and check my folio stuff, dude. Yeah, to be real. I haven't checked Chadley. Um, my Chadley materia. I haven't checked my folio stuff in a while. And if we go to Tyrion Equipment... Um... I think it's under Upgrade Weapons. Oops. I have 15... 15, 5, 15, 10. Yeah, yeah, we got some, we got some folio stuff to do.
Wow. Look at this pretty ass place, brother. God damn. Breathe it in, chat. Just breathe it in. Just breathe in how pretty all this shit is. I just defeated a quest to Coddle. You guys are absolutely screwed. Just like that, man. The Kaiser's screwed. And you know what? You have to realize it is really impressive that there's no loading. It is actually super impressive just on a technical level that all of the zones, all of the towns, all of the environments, everything is interconnected. You go to you go to uh to to calm, you just walk in there. That's it. You go down there, you just walk over there. That's it. Everything is seamless. Granted like it's almost at the cost of foliage movement, right? At the cost of like a good performance mode, you know, shit like that. That's why we need the PC version, to be real. That's the building. At one point, it was used for the storage of Shinra property, but the bandits have since turned it into a hideout and probably filled it with traps. Yeah, we already came to the conclusion why the environmental textures aren't that, aren't that great. If they made all of the environmental textures, like this rock, doesn't look great, clearly. But if they made all of these textures high resolution, guess how big the game would be. Game is already 150 gigs. It no shit with how much different environments there are, the game turns into 300 plus gigabytes. It's not feasible. It's not feasible at all. Even even FF7 Remake, if you increase the textures of that game, fans did it. Guess how big FF7 Remake Part 1 gets with barely any different environments. 150 gigs. It's nuts. It's nuts. It almost becomes like a, a, an issue of efficiency. Where it's just like, well, you know, we can make a game that's that big. But you have to start realizing this isn't like PC games. You can't release a game on PlayStation unless you're like a big boy, like a Call of Duty. And then all of a sudden have your game be like half a terabyte. It's it's unrealistic to make demands like that, where it's like Sony probably has guidances of like your game can't be this big. Well, you're Call of Duty, so you're fine. But most games are rough, dude. Like you can't fit that much data into a game. There's just too many different assets. With Unreal Engine 5, it'd be much more possible, but this is not. UE5 comes with a ton of different issues. And that's the that's the challenge, right? This is one of the only Unreal Engine 4 games that's like this that performs as good as this. Hey, Wasp! I don't get it. Why are we playing dead in the hideout? Obviously, so we can pull one over on the mark, dumbass. Uh-huh. Wake up the dead businessman. The dead businessman? Huh? Hey, wake up you! Wake up you guys. <laughs> I think you people are real thieves. Let's just get that. Real 
Don't say I didn't try to keep it peaceful. You guys met with the wrong legitimate businessman. I'm a bully to these guys because these guys are bullies to other people. Oh my god. Jesus. I'm already weakened from the previous fight, dog. Go on. Burke, eat shit. Okay. There you kill her. No, that didn't work. Get that shit out of here. I'll take care of you. Hey. I can help now. Holy mother of God. I was getting his ass kicked. Dynamic difficulty kicking in. Let's keep us alive. Son of a bitch. God! God! Oh, Aerith. On it. Try using it. Get him. Let's go. Make the most need a breather. Let me teach him a lesson. All right, fixed itself. We're good. Nice little challenge. Yeah, I like it. Come on, you gotta let us off the hook. Off the hook. Off the hook. Off the off the hook. The, uh, off. All we wanted was to sell the treasure for some cash, so we could stop stealing and start fresh. I believe you. It's always been our dream to start a company and do all this work. Hey, we could throw him a bone. Two thousand kills. Yeah. A deal. You guys got yourself a deal. I actually have to to finish the quest. Right. Let's talk corporate structure. I'm president and you're my employee. 
<laughs> We're buddies. That's cool. Me and the buddies are gonna make our business real big. All right, boys. We got work to do. There's glittering riches out there, and your president's gonna work as a servant. Yes, sir, Mr. Press. To the press. So, you think they've turned over a new leaf? Who knows? All I know is that I'm on the verge of death. Excuse me. What is happening? What the hell? Are we gonna play PSO? You get a flashback to like Gilgamesh or something? Gilgamesh isn't in FF7, by the way. Is he is he not? No. Maybe he's a boss fight? Of some kind? Cloud! I have confirmed that you are now in possession of the proto relic. Yeah. I've already taken the liberty of scanning it. It need only analyze the data. Should I happen to pick up other proto relic readings, <coughs> I may request your assistance again. Oh, there is one more thing I should mention. Your device detected a small amount of interference. I can't say for certain, but it's That's not a Knights of the Round thing, no. That's well. Gilgamesh. He's not in Final Fantasy VII. That's what I hope to It's a typical, out. like, it's a summon. I'll be in touch if I learn anything new. Well, that was a big multi-part quest. Holy crap. I'm almost dead. Aerith doesn't have any MP. I don't have any MP. God damn. Wow, that was fun. Well, that was fun. Well, okay then. Shit. What even is there left to do? There's like a few more life springs and stuff like that? Do we have any more? Uh, the combat assignments are finished. We got all the towers. Uh, <clears throat> I guess we should just go grab those. I'm pretty close. Here, let's just do this. Let's go back to calm. Let's go back to calm. Yeah, I imagine. Stay at the end too. Jesus, man. This place is beautiful. Sorry. What are you all about? I was starting to worry. I thought you were here to fix them. <laughs> uh, never mind. Yeah, we're more like demolition experts. So unless you want us to blow something up. How can you make jokes at a time like this? It's downright distasteful. Uh, anyway, what's going on? It's the Mako pipeline. It sprung a leak. I paid a wandering merc to patch the thing up. I certainly wasn't about to fiddle with critical infrastructure as a layman. Though I thought I'd hear back from them by now. A merc? Oh, he's the mayor. I didn't even read that. Some hot shop from Midgard's Undercity. Or so they claim. Sounds like a pro we ought to get to know. Oh, you'd like to meet them? Well, if you're that keen, would you mind delivering a message for a me? A merc? 
Our town technicians laid up in bed at the moment, recovering from a fiend attack. We asked Shinra to send someone to fill in, anyone who knows the work, but we haven't heard back. Fortunately for us, that mercenary rolled into town. Without him, we would have been up a creek. You will? I wonder. Capital. Oh, I wonder who the hell I this is going to be. Myself yet. I'm Fritz Bellinger, the mayor here. I'm sure that mercenary is hard at work over at the warehouse outside of town. Mind asking them to give us an update on the repairs? A simple, it's coming along, would suffice. We are working as hard as we We're can to get the power grid back friend, online. But I think you're the only one who's made a name for themselves in the Undercity. So you don't know who he was talking about? Breaking news. Rest. Hello. Welcome to the inn at Calm. Wait, breaking news. Security forces performed a thorough sweep of the town, during which time it was placed under a temporary lockdown, which has since been lifted as of this report. The suspects remain at large, though public security is confident they will be apprehended soon. Local insurgents are believed to have played a role in their escape. The company will conduct a separate investigation to identify these collaborators and is encouraging residents with any information to step forward. Information which leads to an arrest is subject to a reward. Please making news. Make We're making news. Anti-Shinra terrorist group responsible for the bombings in Midgar is believed to have taken shelter in Kham. Security forces perform... Oh, you're back. I guess that means you managed to shake Shinra. We heard that you've been feeling under the weather lately. Word gets around fast. Didn't expect you to worry about me. But since you're here, can I ask you a favor? A friend of mine wanted me to help her fix one of the old Republic windmills, but I'm in no condition to do that. Oh, I just got the thing for this. Do you think you could instead? Sick. I think we should help. If not for him, we'd probably be back in Hojo's lab. You know, headaches and dizziness. Probably my misspent youth. Paying the price for it now. Hindsight's 2020. Hmm. Headaches and dizziness, huh? Anything else? Sometimes I hear voices, I guess, calling for me, urging me to go somewhere. Sounds pretty crazy saying it aloud. Oh God. Oh God. He's one of the experiments. Oh shit. He was either in soldier or he was one of the folks experimented on when he was younger. Probably for money. I was a company grunt years ago. But when my parents died, I got out to take care of the family business. Been running the place ever since. I'll spare you the grisly details and just say they stole my life from me, my family, my home. Is that reason enough for you? But I thought Calm was your home. Not anymore. This isn't the Calm I grew up in. My Calm was destroyed by Shinra. And this, a soulless imitation. So they did the same thing to Calm that they did to Nibelheim. Because I won't let myself forget what those bastards took. Living in hate can poison a man. Interesting. What the hell? Thank you. <clears throat> Thank you. Please stop My talking to me. My name is Mildred. You should be able to find her somewhere around the old settlement, out on the cliffside. Look for the windmills. During which time it was placed under a temporary huh. lockdown, which has since been lifted as of this report. The Super interesting. Public security is confident they will be apprehended. Yeah, the, uh, so we're trying to find a sweet balance of that as well. The music. I love the music being loud. There's a little bit of a mixing issue. A little bit. Hey, we just pop open all these quests. A rare lost card. 
Um, you think we got what it takes? Drop by the bar, huh? I haven't played Queen's Blood in a little while. Is the bar in here? The burr. Breaking news at this hour. Avalanche. Anti. Hey, how you doing? What? Hey, Mister. You are a winner. Some say. Awesome. That's good enough for me. The name's Vash, and I could really use your help. Truth is, I bungled a Queen's Blood match. Hard. So, not only did my ego take a licking, but I lost a card near and dear to my heart. What I'm getting at is, you think you'd be able to win it back for me? The Chocobo and Moogle one. It's rare. And the one high value card in my whole deck. <laughs> it was the only thing getting me through the daily grind. <laughs> Bullshit, I have to put up with at this job. Fights, late nights, <laughs> drunks. <laughs> this is very important to you, isn't it? Hey, I get it. I'm a bartender too. You, you are? So then you know. <laughs> These side quests are hilarious. These Queen's Blood players are pretty die hard. Don't you think I would if I could? God! I'm a shit player, don't you get that? <laughs> Whatever you say. Hardcore players are willing to throw down hell a gill for rare cards. Please, I'm begging you, you gotta get it back before that asshole tries to sell it. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> I'm a shit player. <laughs> uh. Oh, thank you. Oh my god. But first, I gotta make sure I'm putting my baby's fate in the right hands. Mind if we go around? Oh man, this shit is funny. This shit is mad funny, dude. Some of the some of the characters you run into so far that are just like rando characters are pretty great. There was one character I ran past um when I was testing the stream. And it was in the clock tower. We'll go talk to them again. And it was a couple. And the, the the wife of the couple was was talking about like, I can't believe all this bad stuff is happening at Shinra. I just hope there's something we can do. I feel so bad just sitting here. She goes like on and on and on about like all the world is messed up and everything. Um, and the the husband is like, like, sweetheart, I know, you know, I, I know there's a lot going on, but can we just be romantic for at least once? <laughs> like, can we just can we at least just have some time together? Like, the, there was a little bit of like an argument between them. It was hilarious. I was like, wow, okay. It's just some random NPC you run by. Um, I'll use this deck. Begin. Too real. Yeah, the NPCs are so quirky and wonderful. Um, do we want to mulligan anything? Shh, let's mulligan you. You're a little intense. No, we have some good starters in here. Let's go. Um... What a rip. Get your card off my side. Can you touch your side with my card? Get your card out of here. Uh, dang. Westicodal right at the start might be amazing. Right? I think this is about the best we can get from the start. Let's go. Uh, I think I'm gonna place Dire Wolf. Oh, got the crab. Um, I was gonna place Dire Wolf right here, but I think the crab is better. Crab's better. Okay. Get your shit out of here. Hmm. I 
That turns into a three. And damn, is that good. Uh, my two players aren't great. My riot troopers aren't great at the moment. If I did this one up here, I'm gonna get the three. Yeah. We take the middle. Okay. This game's fun, dude. It takes, it has a learning curve. You know, don't get me wrong. It's got a learning curve. Oh shit. Don't you take the middle. Don't you take the middle. Son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. I think I'm just sacrificing the bottom lane. Right? I think the bottom lane's lost. Yeah, you're screwed. You're screwed. Um, seven? Yeah. Yeah, we're just gonna protect that side. I'm just gonna cover it. We win. We win hard. We won hard. You're not gonna have any single single pawn cards that do that much damage. We're good. Easy win. Pass. I don't even need it, bro. You can take it. I don't even want that lane. I don't even want it. All right. I I like it. So to be to be honest, it doesn't have the um, the approachability of a FF8 card game. Right, that's not Tetra Master. That was, uh, God damn, what's that? What was the name of it? What was the name of the FFA card game? Um, Triple Triad. Thank you. I escaped my head. Doesn't have the the accessibility of Triple Triad. Triple Triad's pretty quickly. You're like, oh, you get you get it, and you get it. Okay. That's um, the kind of skill I'm talking about. And you You'll pretty much dominate the edges, around. right? That's the guy you gotta play. Triple Triad is Black like you card. figure out the strategy what's pretty the quick. Mind kicking his ass for me. And when you're done, come straight back. I'll have a special cocktail waiting with your name on it. <laughs> Got this great recipe. I've been itching to try again. Huh. And to be real, at this hour, what Avalanche it what it's more like is Marble Snap. It's funny. It's much more close to a Marble Snap sort of game. Pile up your lanes, add up the amount, you know, that kind of shit. So is this guy up here near the clock tower? Bright AF over here. Marble Snap was stupid fun. Stupid fun. You're up at the top of the clock tower, huh? Yeah, they very well might actually turn it into a mobile game. I wouldn't be surprised. Oh, dude. You're like down there. You mother. Is this the couple? Wait, listen. From here, Midgar looks the same as ever. Hard to believe it's facing an unprecedented crisis. Uh, yeah. Even if we don't live there, it affects us all. There has to be something we can do to help. Right, right. That's all super important, I agree. But can't we just, like, hold hands and be romantic? <laughs> That's super important at all, but... He's, like, trying to hold her hand, too. Poor guy. It's you. Oh, this is the guy that was guarding the clock tower. We're here for the card you took from the bartender. Ah, the card. So, Vash has resorted to this, hiring people to win his games for him. <laughs> what? Fine, but word of warning, I'm not a pushover like some folks. This is probably the toughest dude in calm. Okay. Uh, I'm pretty happy. You know what? I'm actually not super happy with my riot trooper. They're okay, 
But I don't think I need two of them. Uh, we have the J unit sweeper in there. The Toxirat might be pretty good because it's got... What? Lower the power of the allied and enemy cards affected by three. It's kind of good. Raise the power. Raise the power of allied cards on a... Whoa. That's only one? Dude. I'll take that instead of the B. Uh, that's so good for a, a one. Right? Um, I'll do one less crab. One less Riot Trooper. And give me... This. Alright. This should be fun. Uh... No? That's not what I wanted. Back. Yeah. Yeah, the orange blocks are what they power up or take over. Yeah. Okay, begin. Let's try it out. Give me the cactus, bro. Oh no, I'm I'm chill with this. Oh god, I'm hella chill with this. Let's go. Um Security Officer play one. Grasslands Wolf play one. Not bad. If I can get Security Officer over there, I'll do that. So, if I play the cactus first chat, does it empower anything else? For example, if I play this, uh, like, up here... Oh my god, plus three? Oh my god! Does that always... Do, or, or do we need a card to be there? That's so good! You can put it in whenever. Oh my god, that's so busted! Um... That's so busted. Oh my god, I have a god deck. I have like a god deck right now. Holy shit. I'm not losing this. Okay, well I'm currently losing, but I'm not losing this. Damn it, I can't play it yet. Uh, why aren't you doing anything over there? Oh, I can't play you here, because you're a two. Son of a bitch. No, we definitely do security officer right here. It's too good. This guy has some high-powered AF cards. Oh, this is about to be powerful as shit. Uh, this is- this is the right call. Although... No, no, this is the right call? Oh god, I don't know what to do. Hmm... Hmm... Um... That's also very good. He can't play any more cards? Bullshit. No way. Oh, he has one spot left and I'm taking it. What the hell? What? What happened? I'm confused, dude. What happened? He put himself into a corner? He gambled early for power? Weird. That's mad weird.
Raise the power of allied cards. Um... That's dumb. No, I'm running out of space up there. I need to do like this. No, shit. This ties us. Yes. Yes. Then we put a two up top and we win. Yeah. Yes. Good. Oh, you are so dead. Oh, dude, you are so dead. Oh, you're so dead. I'm taking all of your effing lanes too, bro. You understand that, right? I literally took every lane from you. You're beyond dead. I don't even need to play anymore. You've been cooked. You're a Thanksgiving turkey. Get the hell out of here. Yeah, taking taking board control is so important. Stop it, he's already dead. No! Bury the light deep within. <laughs> this dumb game is crazy fun. Uh, damn. I really lost? It was one hell of a match, though. Am I right? You and I are definitely gonna have to play again sometime. But, uh, not today. Gotta run. Huh? Hold it. Aren't we forgetting something? He didn't even play the card. <laughs> right, the Choco card. The card. He the sold one it. I won off Bash, right? Oh, shoot. Which card was that again? Oh, crap. I remember. The Chocobo and Moogle one. So this is kind of awkward, but I don't have it anymore. You got rid of it. So. No, seriously, I, I flipped it. I was on my last gill, so I had to sell it to a card collector. A guy named Thorin. He runs this card shop outside of town. What? Maybe check with him. Card a shop? This job is never done. Am I right? Card shop? The card shop outside of Calm? What? There's a card shop? Huh? You, the the Yu-Gi-Oh plotline thickens. Wait, Chadley music. Chadley! Chadwick! Your efforts have yielded an astounding amount of data, Cloud. You're damn straight. Perhaps you would like to use it to develop materia? Yes, I would. Um, yeah, I'll take some fire and ice, dog. I have 240 points. I should save some of these, right? Oh no, there's a grasslands icon, so this is only good for the grasslands. Look, look, the coin thing is just a grasslands icon. Oh shit. And I can only buy one. Um, auto cast, let's buy another one of those. Auto ability, I'll buy your last of that. I'll buy your morph, but screw it, dude. Screw it. I'll just buy all the morphs. This is this is just for this reason. Re re reason? So, I mean, I'll, I'll wait just in case. I need to fight I Titan soon. The best in your ongoing hunt for world intel. So the grasslands icon is here. Um, intel. You see, regional data accumulated. The little icon is like a tree and a river. So. And those are the points you get to spend in that area only. I thought they were just world intel points. No, they are for different regions, so they won't work in Junon or whatever. Ah. Ah. Now we gotta do some more VR fights. Sorry, ladies. I'm looking for a card. Dude, where is this? Where is this card guy? What in the dumb shit? Thorin's card shop. Oh, I can just fast travel there. We're running graphics mode because it's beautiful. Graphics mode in this game is insane. It looks so good. 
And yeah, 60 FPS is nice, but there's a big disparity in performance mode to graphics, so it's just so... I've already gotten used to it, man. I have no issues with the frame rate of the game anymore, because it runs solid 30. More jazz? I actually came to here before. Have you been waiting for me your whole life? Oh. Oh shit, he's a psycho. Oh shit, he's a psychopath. Oh my god. Hey there. You folks buying or selling? We're here for the Chocobo and Moogle card. Of course you are. Hate to break it to you, but ain't no way I'm giving up that beaut. At least, not to some dabbler who fancies himself a collector. Unless you more than dabble. Tell you what, you beat me, and that card is all yours. So, you game? Normal TCG players. I can buy cards off you? What? What are the stats, bro? What are the stats? I want to see it. What are the stats? Huh? You have... What? You have big cards. What are the stats? I'm buying it. I don't give a shit. I'm going to find out right now. <laughs> then bust out those cards, boy. <laughs> hey, don't you... You chill. Chill out, man. Oh my sweet Jesus Christ. Creates a surfeit of positions around it when played. Yeah, I noticed. Holy shit, it's a it's a mid-play? Five? Five damage? Oh my god, Titan's also cra Wow! Titan's also crazy good for a two. Raids position ranks by two? What the hell? Oh my god, these cards are dumb. They're 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 busted. These cards are dumb. You're dumb. I'm taking that over the riot trooper. Titan's just a better riot trooper, in my opinion. Or no, Titan is a better one of the J units. I'm gonna swap it out for this. Um Yeah, I'm going to take this over Screamer. Damn, these cards are nuts. Okay. <clears throat> Begin. See what he's got. Yeah, he's got to have some busted shit in his deck, right? Oh, I can play Cactuar top left right at the start. Let's go. Um, That's an incredible starter. Let's rock and roll. Okay. This stupid ass mini game. There's Choco Mog. So what does it do? Can I look at it? I just want to see what it does. Raise power of one for each other enhanced allied card. And it's a low cost. All right, that's pretty. That's pretty good. Um, I can immediately make that a three. Immediately. Or I can play security officer right here? No. No, this, dude, those are bad plays. Bad play. I should play the crab right here. Okay. All right. We pulled a Titan. It's only a two. That's what's crazy. That's the damage up, not the not the, the the power. Okay. Um. We could occupy space with this, for now. I think I should do that. I'll do that. Oh, 
Okay, he's getting a little hairy on the mids. I don't like it. Son of a bitch. Yeah, let's get that. Let's get that space back. We might have lost the bottom, but. But. Oh, no. Oh, no. I want to play the fat chocobo though, but the, the spacing is total shite. Oh, I think we win. Right, I think we've already won the middle, so I don't even have to worry about it. Right? Oh, it's total points as well. Oh shit, it's total points, not just the lane points. Oh, okay. All right, and he can't even play. We, we won. We already won. I'm just gonna, uh, you know, make him feel bad about it. Hold on a second. I'm just gonna shame him a little bit. Let's shame him a little bit. Let's make him feel real bad. Wish he never came into this town. Okay. Let's crush his hopes and dreams. Let's, let's teach him a lesson. Nah, you think I'm interested in passing? You think I want to pass? You think I want to pass? I'm going to BM this guy. Did you hear, what, did you hear all the shit he was talk, talking about? Come on. I'm not even going to say anything. I'm just going to destroy him. I'm not even going to talk shit. I'm just going to destroy him. 28 to 0, dude. Yes. Good lord, that's a 1. That only costs 1. Oh my god. You got some serious skills, son. Jokes on me for thinking otherwise. Okay, we humbled him. Deal's a deal. Here's your card. But next time you go up against me, I'll be bringing my A. -game. We'll probably be coming back to this guy. We'll most likely be coming back to him. So, what can I do? Um, we already got the check, so he's not the same deck right now. If you got the gill, I got the cards. Well, this is fun. Well, this is fun. Yeah, dynamic difficulty ain't working on the card games. I learned how I learned how it operates. This game's fucking awesome! Holy shit, dude! This game's fucking sick. We're in the first area. I've been playing for... I've been AFK for... I've been playing this shit for like 11 hours. This game's fucking sick. Sorry. Let's just go over here and take care of this. Look how pretty this shit is. Did Broden send you? I'm glad for the company. Ain't she a sight to behold? A relic of the Republic of Junon. Shinra can't make him like this, let me tell you. I'm itching to scrape the rust off, get her moving again. Easier said than done, unfortunately. The rotor's missing a key component, one that's a bitch to find. <laughs> Which is where you come in. I'm gonna need your help to well, get Well, I have good part. news for you. So, what do you want to know? We go way back. Like, way back. The two of us skipped town when we were young, you know? Thought we'd experience what the world had to offer. Eventually, we went our separate ways. He joined the military, and I became an engineer. 
Well, turned out he was a natural born trooper. Was even handpicked to take part in a super secret experiment. And there it is. It wasn't long after that we lost contact. And there it is. At the time we reconnected, he'd already put that life behind him. What experiment? I have to ask him, though I doubt he'd tell you. Certainly won't tell me, at any rate. Whatever they did to him, though, has something to do with his condition. I just know it. He's been to doctor after doctor, but all the tests come back inconclusive. So I'm digging through old Republic archives, looking for something that might help, something a doctor might overlook. Just hope I find what he needs soon. Oh, this is so cool. I know all the I know all the rest. Windmills counting on you, friend. So I have really good news for you. You already have it. <laughs> yeah, here you go. How's dynamic been? Up. Uh, we've had some tough fights. Some legit tough fights. It's actually been kind of great. Now that is a quality design. No Shinra knockoffs can compare to Republic ingenuity. Okay, time to see if she works. <laughs> Cloud and Red just look at each other. Of course. It's amazing. Incredible. Of course. The blades are spinning. Actually spinning. What a sight. Oh, I can't wait to find out how much power it can generate. I wish Broden was here for this. He'd have loved to see these windmills running again. Maybe one day. Well, anyway, thank you. You've helped me fulfill a dream of mine. Guess you're heading back to Calm? That's the plan. When you see Broden, you tell him, hurry up and get better, would ya? We got a whole wide world to see. Or something along those lines. When you see Broden, you tell him, hurry up and get better, would ya? Side quests have been pretty great so far. And what did we get out of this? Cleansing materia. So, Isuna? Uh, Poison on Isuna, yeah, and resist. Okay. Ain't got much space for it, but you know. Okay. Oh, I have to start putting on cool new materia. Hang on a second. We have fire and healing. What about I do fire and ice? Sounds good to me. Uh, I might need to go buy another fire and ice materia. That might be valuable this point. Healing wind. Lightning on Barret. Lightning on Tifa. Lightning ice on Tifa. Yeah. Oh, was there only one? There was something else he had that was like multiples that I could buy. Something. Okay. Um. What the hell was down here? Maintenance warehouse. Autocast, that's what it was. It was an autocast materia. I'll just pull a grenade out of this. Here's the warehouse the mayor was talking about. <laughs> Place looks fresh out of Mercs to me. Did someone say Merc? I know you. You're that Sector 5 chick who was shitting on Avalanche. What? Is that Cloud? <sighs> but I was sure this wasn't your turf. Don't tell me. You're the Merc the Mayor hired? Kyrie doesn't work for free. Or cheap. <laughs> this girl. How either of you get any work is a mystery to me. <laughs> We're here on behalf of the Mayor. Man wants a progress report. Yes, progress is what I've been making. And I'm 
just dying to tell him all about it. But the thing is, uh, I haven't actually like done anything. I need more parts. You have a theme, Kyrie? Wouldn't it be fun if we look for them together? Hell no. I could really use a guiding hand from a vet in the industry. Like you. I swear I'll do anything. Anything? Fine. I'll help. If you stop calling yourself a merc. You, sir, have a deal. Okay, so these are the parts that I need. More would probably be better, but that number there's the bare minimum. So, any questions? You can probably find them in scrap heaps somewhere nearby. I mean, I know you can. Sweet! See you soon! I thought you were coming with us. No, I need to stay here and look for screws and hoops. Yeah. Yeah. Pipeline repair parts. All right, the friggin'. Grabbing nails and shit. Well, that's very far. Time to dig around the trash. What? Oh, God, it's like up the mountain, dude. Oh, God. Go to this one right now. Oh, I'm here. Chicken! Please! Chicken zoomies, please. There it is. She also has a battle theme? What the hell? Wow. They also gave her a friggin' battle theme. Wow. Music team went extra ham. Okay. I'm, uh, liking this quest the more and more I'm listening to the music. Are you actually trying to fix? 
Is it this one? Grandma didn't send you out here to find me, did she? Because if she did, I'm not going back. I'm sick of her treating me like a little kid, never letting me join her on a job. So I packed up and hit the road. Now I'm out here making my fortune. I can't wait to rub my success in her smug face. Calamur, defend me! Time to take a Are you sure you want to fight? <laughs> This ends on you. I'll show you what I can do, okay? No time you for you. Okay. Damn. Now, suddenly dead. Let's get going. Wow. Okay, so suddenly this crappy side quest is actually kind of sick. Okay. Well, here we are. And you're sure that you can fix this? Huh. You shouldn't underestimate an undercity girl. I can spin garbage into gold and will. What the dumb hell is that? Uh, company! Stay back. Yes, you're not going to attack me? You deal with that. I'll take it. Weakness to fire. Eric got silenced. Go on. Here. What am I looking at? It's over. Together. All together. Okay. It explodes. Mako probably mutated it. Look at Mr. Know It All. <laughs> okay, that ought to do it. Mission accomplished. And my reward secure. <laughs> Let's go and grab a drink. Celebrate the birth of our great mercenary unit. Forget our deal already? Not interested. The point is, I can help you. I can talk you up. Please don't. Well, since you're the only merc in town, guess this one's all yours. Get back here. Mother of God. <laughs> Fungal counter. No, how about no? Well, the music was interesting. The, the, the music was interesting. Brock Obersoul, Barely Conscious Gaming. Appreciate it, guys. And Green Wolf, welcome. Thank you for the 108, God Jinrai. We got a lot of stuff to turn in, huh? Report, report, deliver the card. Yeah, we got a lot of stuff to turn in. Okay. 
Well, that was fun. Herself. She told me how you helped with the pipeline repairs. And sure enough, thanks to you, the Mako is flowing again. We're in your debt. Where's your Merc now? I'm not sure. She left just as soon as I paid. For another job, perhaps. Guess that's what we're we'll running into her again. You. Plenty of work and never enough time in between. <sighs> Sounds like you still got competition, Merc. Before you run off, she set this aside for you. Insisted that her fellow mercs be compensated. All right. Well, okay. I'm glad to see everything's back. It's such a relief to no longer be literally scraping the bottom of the barrel. Maybe I'll finally get a restful sleep tonight. They really should have gotten on it sooner. But at least it's fixed now. Dude, there's nothing on that. That's so. If Mildred's happy, I'm happy. She said you've got a world to see. <laughs> she just wants an excuse to travel. But I am overdue for a vacation. Think I've been working myself too hard lately. Rest would do you good. What is this terrible scent? It's reminiscent of Hojo's lab. <sighs> it's time. Time to go. To leave. You okay? It's just the degradation. Every soldier's got to make their peace with it. Now you know why I can't see any old doctor. You're a soldier too, aren't you? Ex-soldier, actually. Didn't mean to scare you. The symptoms aren't always the same. And who knows? You might be one of the lucky ones. Right. Just don't take your youth for granted. All right? You only get one shot at life. And you can't let Shinra take it from you. You can't let them win. All right. Damn. Breaking news at this hour. Avalanche. Oh damn! Quest got deep all of a sudden. I got the uh, a really good scarf. That's the scarf from the first game. Wow. Cat and dog and cactuar. I would not piss it off. Don't. Do not piss that thing off. Yeah, all the other dialogue is so sick. So fun. You got my baby back! To be honest, this isn't the first card I've lost. And considering just how many I've lost, one this rare is definitely wasted on me. Here. It's probably better off with you. Someone who isn't trash. But only until I've gotten good enough to win it back. Whew. That's a weight off my mind. Right, enough of that. How about I fix you two your drinks? So, 
This guy moved here recently from Midgar, left after the Sector 7 tragedy. You know how it is. Anyway, he kept raving about this incredible cocktail served at a famous bar in the Undercity. The Cos... Seventh the, Heaven. The Great Cosmo. Have heard of the joint? <laughs> they called it the Cosmo The Cosmo Canyon. Canyon. Pretty, don't you think? Go on. Drink up. Thanks. This is this is so sweet. Jesus. You know, that was just what I needed. Knew you'd like it. Although apparently my version pales in comparison to the Undercity original. So much so, the guy flat out refuses to order it again. <laughs> Pinch of salt. That'll give it the kick it needs. Trust me. Salt, huh? Hey, that's pretty clever. Yeah, maybe I'll try that. Wait, don't tell me. You're the one who invented the Cosmo Canyon, aren't you? You're that Seventh Heaven bartender. Not today, but someday soon. When we do open up a new place, swing by. I'll make you a Cosmo Canyon myself. <laughs> okay, but I'm holding you to that. I'll be there opening night with bells on. I promise. Jesus, man! All the side quests are so good! Jesus! Yo, Cito Haitian, thanks for the 10 gift subs. How are all the side quests so good? All of them are like making the characters great. Everything's super charming and blinding! All right. Oh. I have one more side quest to do. It's the wildflower side quest. <clears throat> yeah. The region map. Uh, where do I got to go for this? Yeah. There we go. Am I doing 100% run this game? I don't know, man. I'm just I'm just doing stuff until it's not interesting. I did not mean to 100% the grasslands. But everything I've done has just been increasing in levels of, like, interesting. So, I'm just doing it. It's all fun. I mean, I'm having fun the whole time. What the hell? Am I right on top of it? Huh? There it is. I had no intention. No intention of, like, playing all this stuff. I still haven't even fought Titan yet. Again. But here's the thing, like, the side quests are crafted in a way where they've been good, so guess what I want to do? Another side quest. I want to do another one. We're definitely going to go fight Titan again. What's our life looking at? Oh, I need to heal. Can I hear from a chocobo? Of course I can. Of course I can. Well, not I'm out, I'm out of MP, but who cares? I ain't even been over here yet. I ain't even been over here. I ain't even been over here. Here's the, uh, I mean, I had to time out that person saying you're going to get burned out on this. I had to time you out because here's the difference. I actually like this shit. Here's the difference. I've just played Remake, all of its expansion, and the original Final Fantasy VII. And people are like, how can you keep playing this? You're going to burn yourself out. 
The difference is that I enjoy this. Here's the, compared to like other streamers that you might have watched, I love this shit. I love it. I love this shit I stream, which is why I stream it. So just as a heads up. I've been waiting for this shit for 20 plus years. And I've been willing to wait. Now, excuse me while I fight all of this dank herb in this flower field. Jesus Christ. Deal with that. Oh, these things are all dead. I keep my distance if I were you. Yeah, dude, Storm wow, kicked them all out. All of them. I've never seen these kinds before. So, know which ones to pick? Yeah, I got this. As much as I want to believe you, your face says otherwise. I'm good. Good thing you've got me here. Sort of reminds me of when we picked flowers for the leaf house. <laughs> Look at this camera, dude. Whoa. <laughs> Wait a minute. Aerith, chill. <laughs> hey, hey, get over here. Where's, where's my cat? <laughs> where's my cat? <laughs> this camera is so funny. Uh, all right. So seriously, I obviously need uh, uh, red ones. Can I pick this weird dang shit? Or are these just dead flowers? Dead flowers. Dead un unloaded flowers. Um, pick flower zero of three. Okay. Rod. Oh, now these are vibrant. So you like deep, passionate reds, do you? Chill out, chick. Yo, Khan. And Gungiver, thank you, That's dude. Start, Happy two years. But we're definitely gonna need more. You definitely see some yellow stuff in there, right? I don't see any white flowers. Oh, they're over there. Okay, get the yellow stuff. So cute and soft too. Perfect for a flower crown. Yes. Indeed. Flower lady. couldn't hurt this mission is not for colorblind people and I guess the white ones I see a little bit of green but I see more white ones Tifa's hanging out over here so I'm going wow, here wow these smell heavenly definitely the right choice if you want something fragrant sure Barrett shoots off the flowers with his gun arm damn look at this place dude Jesus Should probably be enough. Let's go give him to Chloe. Cool. Make the ocean so blue that almost looks like cleaning fluid. Is that really all that's over here? Is this massive zone just for that? Really? Jeez. 
Sheesh. Floating. I'm gonna look around a bit more. What's over here? Claw, don't do it. Oh yeah, maybe we actually choke about stuck on random things. Um. Oh, this place is explorable in here. How oh, weird. There's nothing here now. This might be utilized later. bunch of nothing. Like real life. Bunch of nothing out here. Bunch of goddamn garbage everywhere. Whoa. That's something, I guess. You don't find things to pick up out here because it's all effed up. Yo, Leafy Dude, thank you very much. All right. Let's go turn this quest in. Uh, yeah, back to here. Okay. I might have to help Chadwick fight Titan. I'm kind of worried though. What if mine's not as pretty as mom's? Well, lucky for you, I just so happen to be a florist. Oh god. I'd be more than happy to help you put one together. Really? We'll make two. Right, Cloud? Sure. Look! It's just like mom's. But this one's all yours. Yeah, I didn't think I could do it, but I did. You two are the best. I couldn't have made this without you. Yeah, you could. Believe in yourself. Thanks. There's something I can help you with? He was oh, just standing there. Billy! Here, for you. Oh, did you make this? Uh-huh. <laughs> Thanks. So? <laughs> Cute, don't you think? Yeah. Put this on your head. Cute. <laughs> you weird kids. <laughs> Damn. B -b -b Bam. Let's wreck this place. I appreciate you helping out Chloe. Wreck this place. Sorry. You'll have to clean all that up. Do you think Grandpa would like one of my flower crowns too? Uh, material trade, yeah. So I have a ton of these now. I'll take it. Take it. I'll take it. If you ever want to change your chocobo's gear, feel free to use the stable just over there. I will. I'm doing it. The Choco Boutique. Good goddamn. Uh, I have a helmet. That's a lot. Right, that's a lot. Edit the colors. <laughs> Created color? What goes good with yellow? Yellow and red. Hmm. 
Let me get my McDonald's chicken. Chat. Can't change the saturation of it? Oh, I can. Yeah, yellow and red, chat. Come on. What are you thinking? Wait. Colors. Edit this color. It's my McChicken. You damn straight. I was right. Damn straight. My McChicken goes hard. Now I have to go to make these chickens dance. Chadley, I got to talk to you, I know. But I got to get some folios done. We do some folios. All right, jeez, I got a lot. Yeah, good point. I've been, like, unlocking these things, and I don't know if I've used any of them yet. Have I not? These abilities are weird. Unleash a wind attack without expending MP, right? But, like, how? Oh, the counter fire is so sick. Yeah, I haven't gotten any of these to, like, work yet. All we need is the wildfire one, because I actually have fire on Cloud. And I'm going to get into a fight, I just want to see. They might just be abilities. And I definitely want this. Counterfire. It works on everybody. Team up with your partner in time with an enemy's ranged attack to unleash a counter strike. Hell yeah. Right, you got 10 points to spend. Counter spin potency? It's five. Uh, you also have Wildfire. Wind one. It's weird that it's balanced differently on some characters than others. Right? Do the wind one with you. Got Aerith. What did you get? Okay. Max MP by three. That's not so exciting. Aerith, I think, had, uh, the arrow one. Let's try this. They also give alpha versions of spells. Yeah, I didn't really understand what the heck that was for. Three charge ATB gauge? Oh man, that is sick. I should probably get this. To work on this one over here. Yeah, refocus is now in the folios. Refocus a folio. Cool. Barrett got something sick. I don't know why he'd want to use that. Oh yeah, you need a partner skill. Did not have a partner skill on Barrett yet. Oh, bueno. Um, ATB charge rate up? Damn. Damn. Well, is that good? There's the refocus there.
I need to use that, dude. I need to start paying attention to some of my synergy abilities. Right? And right. I have 20 to use here. So I definitely should buy this one. This is amazing. And this is also amazing. She just became an ATB god. Fiery Impulse. Let's do Ice Impulse for you. Even more ATB. All right. The Fulios are done. I'm going to go to get into a, a back alley brawl and just see what this stuff does. Yo, Shinobius Worm. Thank you. Jesus Christ, you guys. Yeah, chill. Yeah, regular battle. I just want to see this. Oh, Chocobo Jim, what are you doing out here? Heard how you helped Chloe with that flower crown of hers. Awful sweet of you. Only wish Will and Clara were around to see it, but they made their bed. Oh, <laughs> apologies. Will's my son. Clara's his wife. Billy and Chloe are theirs, if they haven't already told you. Bill, Will, Billy. Damn, Bill. We clear out like all the monsters? Huh? There's something down here. I want to try this ability. God damn. Okay. Hey, what are you doing here? Did I miss something? Did I miss something out here? You crazy chicken? Huh? I did. Wait, these guys gotta get fought. Take the lead. I'll show you what I can do. Unleash a wind magic attack over white area without spinning MP. Enjoy the ride. Damn, these are great. I need to assign you these to something. This one's for you. So bad. You can use them while- wait a minute. You can use them while airborne? So, like, you can be in the air and do the magic pull, like Nero, and pull people towards you, like you're effing Devil May Cry. Wow. Yeah, like, they can be combo extenders. They can be done in the air. So much stuff. A golden plume. I don't think I needed a rest. I did not. Crap. Thinking about eating pizza. You have a reliable way to do air combos? Um, every character's different, but with Cloud, just dodge and then hold down square. He dashes and is in the air and you start the air combo. He doesn't have a launcher like Zack has. It's a bit different. One sec, chat. Okay. Wait, like Zach has? Uh, never mind. Sorry. 
sorry. You gotta realize that some people have not played the beginning of the game. Go back and talk to Chad. Yeah, Tifa gets airborne with synergy abilities with Cloud. Okay, Chad. I heard that you assisted the Moogles in opening their shop. It's said that Moogle Metals, their unique currency, is imbued with a preternatural power to lift one's spirits. Perhaps collecting these metals and delivering them to the Moogles will bring us that much closer to a planet replete with joy and laughter. Now let me use your combat simulator. Um... Yeah. Uh... Let's just try this. Thought Aerith Red. Let's just try this. August, thank you. Keep it together. It's your turn. Oh my god damn! Oh god damn, my god. Oh, he's whacking me. Oh, that still hit me. Jesus. Stand a chance, dude. Oh no. Oh no, Titan did not stand a chance. Only the strong survive. Oh god, I just let Red get leveled up a little bit and it was like, uh oh. Dang. Okay. Congratulations on toppling Titan. Though legendary, his earth shattering strength was no match for your own. I'm sure he'll provide this was nerfed times support. two, not You're times three. Hands now, and rather large ones at that. What other combat sim stuff do you have? Back to the future, Chadley Simulator. Uh, to max out Titan, we gotta go find the other springs. It says 13 of 16 and Oh my god damn it, dog. And that's how I learned the enemy skill. I gotta go ass ass a couple of more dudes. Oh my god, Chadwick, please. Ooh, first strike, I'll take that. Don't take first strike materia. I missed a doom rat somewhere. Swear to god. Son of a bitch. That's a lot of guys. Lost. 
But you don't do that. Damn, red. Sick. Oh, assessing mobs in the simulator also counts. All right. If I see anything weird in here, I'll, I'll ass ass it. That's not a weird one. Auto cast assess. That sounds amazing. Jesus Christ. The Toxa rat I can assess? All right. If I see any more dirty ass. There they are! Oh no, I, I've assessed these. Yeah, assessed. Oh no. These are two, whoa. These are the rare ones on top of the rare ones? You dared! This game is so sick, dude! This game is so sick! Don't stop now! Let's do this! This game is so sick, dude. My god damn. How good is this friggin' shit? How good is this shit? First strike material get. Yeah, the longer battles are in are incredibly cool. Um plain stalkers. Okay. I'll just I'll just do a uh, a quick check of assessment, right? Dude, we haven't even continued the story yet. Like, just the gameplay itself is hook enough. So, I don't know if I looked at the loco weeds on the Mandragoras uh, assessed. Uh, switch target. Not assessed! <laughs> My God! Oh my God! I'll show you what I can do. One more shot. Go on. <laughs> God damn! God damn! It's one of the most loading in the game is in these things. All right. I don't think we assess these guys. They're from like the beginning of the game. God. Oh, 
son of a bitch. God damn it. Gotcha, bitch. So sick. I, dude, I have so many abilities on Tifa. I have to learn how to use them. I think I, I think I assessed these guys. I did. She has like, she stays in the air like it's Marvel versus Capcom. Oh, dude, this game is something else. I keep getting access to this, to more stuff, and this game is something else. Holy hell, dude. So cool. <laughs> she just did like Jinrai Kyaku on me. Uh, provoke materia. All right. I have to pick Cloud. No, I don't? I can pick different teams? What? I can actually pick different teams? I don't have to... I don't have to play Cloud? bird first. I definitely got to attach those spells to the other shit. Go for it. I'll take care of them. Why don't you leave the way? Let's go. There. Ah! On. Good lord. Good lord. Oh, I can't ass ass without cloud. That's right. You're right. I can't ass ass without cloud. That's my bad. And I could definitely have ass ass these guys, son of a bitch. Get him. That's it. Get ready. Oh no. Okay. Sorry, but I gotta. I keep my distance too much. No 
we'll see. Looking for me? It's your turn. All set. Come on. God damn, dude. God damn. Hindsight is something else. No clown in the party. Oh my god. won't work because she's she's screwed stop pecking him Thanks. stupid freaking bird stupid bird try it again there's an encounter hit state i don't believe it i don't believe it Aerith's still a frog? Okay. Holy shit! Weakness to ice. Go for it. It's your turn. I got it. Huh. Right. There. Oh. Finish him off. There. It's on you. Leave it to me. Take over. Here goes. Get ready. Get him. I'm not going to summon Shifa for a squirrel. works for me for a squirrel With no time to waste okay okay there were things in there that I could uh ass ass for sure there was definitely two so was it the plains stalkers no it was the natural order. So Cloud. Let's go with Tifa and Red. So I need to ass ass these guys with Cloud and we're, we're clear. Where are you at, dude? There we go. Cool.
Yeah, load these guys in. This is what I need. Oh, hi. You son of a bitch. I don't believe it. Watch this. Whatever. I got this. I'll give him your all. Get in there. Don't stop now. Red, why am I looking at this enemy? Don't let us now. No! Son of a bitch! They died too fast! Everyone ganged up on him! Oh god! Oh god! Wonder if it counts it, huh? Do you count it? Do you count the ass ass? You don't! You don't! Oh no! Uh, plain stalkers? Natural order? It was natural order, right? No, I was at 14. Um, Cloud, Tifa, Red. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I didn't count it from the restart. So, this bird's been assessed, just to be sure. Assessed, assessed. I don't know, let her rip. Damn it. That other guy died already? What? It acted as a counter? It acted as a counter. Oh my god. Okay. Let's just stay with Cloud at the start just to make sure we get all our stuff. Get out of here. That thing is flying. So dumb. So dumb. Just like that. 
There we go. I think we did it. Assess scans all enemies? Does it... Oh, really? You don't have to assess individuals anymore? Oh, that's amazing. It's an all active? Oh, that's amazing. That's so much better. Son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. Dude, I keep getting interrupted by these pieces of shit. He jumped in the air and got me. Snowballed. Woo. Okay. Small wonder Okay. Cool. Very cool. Fighting is very cool. Uh and are we good? I have to assess them in the grasslands. Alright, good to know. It's good to know. That's good you made to know. short work of that simulation. I did, thank you. Thank you very much. I had to ask ask them in the goddamn grasslands. I'm mentioning, but I've observed that world intel collection is stalled of late. Jesus. I'm certain, however, a veteran mercenary like you would never abandon a task. I know you must be busy, but I'd appreciate your help. Chadley, I'm gonna spank you. You start calling me out on this shit, you're gonna get spanked. You're gonna learn the human ways. Bad, Chadley. No good. Um, God, man, what do I have to do? What do I have to do? Enemy intel. Uh, these bandits, I ain't getting those. A Toxa Rat, the White Terror, I'm not, I, that's not happening again. I need to go find a Toxa Rat? The Zoo? That's in the Nobel region. Nobel region. A Spearhawk. Oh god, I could have assessed that. Titan, oh no. Are you telling me I'm, like, gonna be one short? Are we being serious? Toxarat's like the one thing. I don't believe it. I don't believe it. Um... <laughs> we only need two. And maybe I could redo the White Terror? 
No, Titan doesn't count. Titan does not count. Uh, you have to scan new enemies. They need to be in the grasslands. The Toxa rat is like around here. Ish. I can't believe I'm in a... I can't believe it's four years later. And I haven't scanned a rat. I can't believe it. It's four years later and I haven't scanned a friggin' rat. There's one. Now here's the problem. It needs to survive. What am I doing? Why am I getting so aggressive? No! Time to waste. My rat. That was my rat. They died too fast. Can't help it. I'm bloodthirsty. Okay. I can't stop this about me. It's who I am. Let's wait for those mobs to pop back up again. Son of a bitch. I can't ass ass these deer. These dur. Down here. Right? There's gonna be stuff down here. I'm going down here. See, there's a burb. That was a cool combo, right? Dude, I, I literally think I'm gonna add all those abilities to the shortcut commands. No kidding. The Swamplands probably count as the Grasslands. It's the Grasslands region. Which includes the Swamplands, I think. I mean, I think. I guess we're going up here. Let me guess. <laughs> Fiends love to be hunted. They do. Impulse attacks don't give synergy. Interesting. Okay. We're almost there, boys! I'm about to become God of the Grasslands. I'm gonna kick Titan down and take his throne. Fucking king of this place. All the animals are gonna bow to me and shit. It's gonna be dope. Oh, is there maybe an inventory limit? It says I couldn't obtain things. Maybe there's a limit of 99. It's gonna be like the Lion King. Hold up. Let me go make some stuff. If that's the case. Uh, yeah, you can only make nine. You can only have 99. Uh, it's the top. It's the maximum. But I can make mist potions now. Um, and in fact, let's make like 10 of these.
And let's make a bunch of mixed potions. Okay. Mist potions were what? 350 HP mixed potions. 350 HP. HP. Wait, tell me what the mist the mist potion does, dude. I have any of you. Uh, Easter, Eith, Easter, Ether. That's all allies, yeah. That's hella good. The top screen. Oh, 350 wall allies. There it is. Um, these I can't do. They're for later. Okay. What? Cool. Chicken defeated. Very dank over here. Okay, so we got that. Uh, that's nothing down there. Extra dank over here. Is the lighting over here nice? You guys like it? You know what I did? I actually turned the brightness down, and I think it made the game look better. The brightness option in the game was making it look very washed out. And all the contrast and uh, color of the image came back when the brightness went back down. So all I did was just change the gamma on the stream, uh, contrast adjusted, and it was like, yeah, it looks way better. It's much better, yeah. You lose so much image quality when you turn the brightness up in game. It's rough. So it's almost like, yeah, you got to deal with it. I don't love that, <laughs> you know? I don't love that. Uh, so there's multiple things over here. You got to go down and check out. I think my McChick my McChicken is the only one. Yeah. So pretty sure this is safe. Heard pockets of the bark are damn near bottomless. Plus, there's that giant man eating serpent. Bill assured us the chocobos could handle it. Have some faith in our feathered friends. Quang. <laughs> Where's this at? The people of the grasslands once believed that earthquakes would occur if they angered Titan. Kong's present day harvest festival most likely originated as a ritual offering of crops meant to appease him. Is that just over this way? Oh, this didn't have any yellow paint on it. I didn't know if I can climb on it. There's no way to know. Suddenly, this is Shadow of the Colossus. What the hell? We're way up here, dude. Like, we're way up here. When I rate the very early portion of this game, uh, insane. First area, insane. First couple hours, ins like, unbelievable. Like, I can't even... It's so much fun. Okay. Let's do this. See how much harder this gets. Uh-oh. Okay.
Oh, that was good enough? Dang, you're very generous, game. Thank you. You're very generous. Oh, we're almost at party level three. Almost. Titan Materia improved. I gotta equip that, by the way. That concludes our analysis of the Grassland Summon Crystals. Thank you. Now Titan will become an even more formidable ally. Congratulations. Cool. Um, yeah, speaking of which, dude, let's put that on Cloud. Let's put Titan on Cloud. It's probably gonna be crazy good, right? Because of the stats. I haven't even had a chance to see Chocomog yet. Four-star Titan. Uh, believe it or not, it's all defensive. Magic attack luck goes down. But vitality goes up by a lot. I like 25%. Cool. Oh, did I have uh, anybody else that did not have summon? Uh... Barrett, how did you get another... Is Barrett's gun getting more abilities? What the heck, chat? Where is that? Barrett got another materia slot out of nowhere. So his weapon levels up, but where do I see that stuff? I've been looking for it. Yeah, I get it. It's from, like, leveling weapons, but... Is there not a spot that we can look at where, like, what the increases are? Main menu, upgrade weapons. Okay, let me go look before I start equipping stuff. I, I saw this. So, yeah, Barret, right? Click. The Gatling gun, weapon level three. Stat boosts. Okay, I see that stuff. But you can't control the stat boosts. You can only control the weapon skill. Right? This is it. Is what I'm saying. You just get it. Right? I can I can choose these. I understand that. But I don't think I can actually similar to FF7OG, I don't think I can actually see the stat boost things. I think that that takes place automatically. And my auto upgrade is set to manual, so I haven't actually been doing that. You know? I haven't actually been touching it. So... Yeah, I don't think I can set a path, because the whole point of the stat boost stuff, right? That was what you could control. And this, I guess the weapons just naturally upgrade now. This might be for skills, yeah. This, this, I think this is specifically for the weapon skills. Bottom left, where? The weapon level, we know that. I'm trying to see like what the, the all the passive stat boosts are, or if I can control them. Yeah, so it's like the weapon skills now you control, and now all the stat stuff seems to be automatic. Is what it seems like. Okay. They're just passive. Yeah. All right. I was like, am I missing something here? Can I actually choose what to? Oh my God. My wife has brought me delicious food. Yeah, I see the levels, chat. I mean, I see that. You're saying bottom right. I mean, I obviously see that. Stat boosts and everything. I see what they are. What I'm trying to say is similar to part one. I want to choose what those things are. And where you make those choices. So, bottom right said what you get next level. Where? Hold on a second. Where do you guys see it? Increases link, links the materia slot. Is that not the stuff I already have though? Adds an additional weapon skill slot. No, it isn't because I don't have any link materia. It isn't. Okay. That stuff is separate. Yeah, that's what I can get. So... I'm trying to figure out, like... 
Oh, weapon skill and stat boost at upcoming level. Gotcha. Gotcha. So where do I check out a breakdown of what's on here already? Like what I what I have. Is there anything? I see I see all this stuff that's obvious with the acquired weapon skills. That's what you get at level four. Oh. Now the top right is just weapon skills, chat. I doesn't it doesn't say anything of that. I just got an extra materia slot, you know? Uh Yeah, I'm looking to see if there's like a log. You can't see past level ups? I don't think so. I'm just trying to make sense of this, right? Like where this information actually is, because this is a little... I lost interest. I was... You like it? Good, if they let you. Very good girl. And then called JJ a good girl chat. It's talking about Ripley. <laughs> Chat's weird. Damn. That's what? Pizza's bad good too. Yeah. I had a slice. Triangle button from this screen just tells you the weapon skill. Yeah, there's no skill trees with the weapons. There's skill trees on the characters now. And by the way, excitement adds an additional weapon skill slot at the next level. So, you know, hell yeah, dude. Additional weapon skill slot, additional weapon skill slot. Increases the number of available materia slots. This is so sick. Thank you. Isn't it great? Yeah. Pretty great. Yeah, all the weapons level up together, which is which is nice. But I was just figuring out if we if we lost that from from part one, where it's like, oh, did we lose all those cool stat things? Um, and is it only dude attack plus twenty? Did we lose all those cool stat things? And is it just weapon skills now? And long story short, no, we didn't. They're they're all still there. It's just that it is simplified. The weapon, the weapon just levels up and gives you stuff now. It's automatic. Instead, the folio stuff is where you actually make choices. Do you like the skill tree from the previous game or this game? I mean, they're both... I think I missed the space thing. Okay. Right. D deeply. deeply. Yes.
The sushi chat. Very good sushi. JJ got it for me. <laughs> I love you so much. <laughs> you oh this is so good chat's like what kind of sushi um this is what's on top albacore albacore on top albacore and avocado in the middle inside the roll is crab cucumber and shrimp tempura got that chat it's insanely good with like a i want another one with like a spicy it's a chili oil chili spicy oil mayo, spicy mayo. mayo it's so good it's mad spicy too one more Ripley likes sushi. We tried. No. She's too picky right now. She loves ginger. God, it was so good. Thank you. This video. Get up. Get up every once in a while. Oh. <sighs> <sighs> So we got Titan. There's something deep in here. Oh, dear. Can I jump back up that? Yes. A chicken's just chilling over here. Chicken stuck. They outdid themselves with this combat, dude. They outdid themselves with this world. Like, I'm really digging all of the environmental stuff. I'm having a great time. Look at these spooky ass bloodborne trees. What is this? Is this an old ass reactor? Look at this place, man. Birds, get out of here. Shouldn't be here. Yeah, I gotta get up there. Find a way up there. These creepy ass bloodborne trees. The resources respawn? I'm assuming so. I couldn't tell you exactly. I gotta find a way up here.
Yeah, we found Miyazaki. There it is. We found uh, Miyazaki's uh, poison swamp. Missed any side quests yet? I probably haven't done all of them. I'm just doing the ones that I'm coming across. I'll have to actually pay attention if I've gotten them all. Oh, wow. Mist Vale Reservoir. Huh. That's helpful. High potion. with the uh, moment 37 parries. Oh, it was a Mog Metal. That's good. In progress verdict. My in progress verdict is that if any of the remainder of the game is a quarter as good as this, this game is going to be fucking godlike. And I don't want to know anything about the rest of the game. I don't want to know anything. <clears throat> Beastman armband, really? I'm finally getting something I can put on cloud that's not terrible? About base level one slaughter. Uh, Eastman armband. Magic defense, though. I mean, go on Aerith? No, I don't know who that would go on. Right? I don't know who that would actually go on. It's minus three. Ah, it goes on Earth because it's just better. Wait. God damn it, Bobby. Can't do that. Son of a bitch. Maybe it's better than the Hunter's Bangle? Ew. No, it is not. I'm gonna I'm gonna hold off. Ooh, 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 ooh. Well, I think the opinion of the game being Ubisoft is valid, because it has been. But, at least with my experience, everything that has been a Ubisoft in this game has led to great rewards and cool story stuff. The towers, you know, going out and collecting things. All of it has essentially given me dope shit. The bird knocked around the box. So to me, I'm fine with it. Like, I've, I've done almost everything in the grasslands, and I am anxious to check out the rest of the story, but at the same time, it's all been good. It's been fun. So I've wanted to keep looking for shit. And it's also come with, like, incredible music and nice area variety. The, 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 the best part about this entire grasslands is that it has not been visually the same thing, right? As soon as you get down here, the entire environment starts changing. As soon as you, like, go on this side, the environment starts, like, different music plays and shit like that. You know, it doesn't feel like I am... Uh, I'm just, like, grinding away at all the stats and stuff like that. It doesn't feel like I'm doing that, which is the problem with Ubisoft games. You feel like you're just doing the just chore list, you know? I'm cool every single time I run into one of these things because of the fucking music. <laughs> Right? Because the music here is amazing, and they give you a ton of rewards. 
that I can't carry because I have so many of them. Oh yeah, and the combat in the game is incredible, and all of the stuff that you get uh, helps you in combat. All of the side quests technically help your combat because they work towards the folios. It's super smart. And then what do you get by doing more combat? What do you get by doing combat stuff? More combat. No shit. Yeah, the, the remakes side quest 100% felt like they were ruining the pacing of the game. For Upon sure. analyzing the data from the life spring, I was able to locate a new transmuter chip. It's among the refuse left over from the pipeline's construction. Though a touch far from your current location, it's a rather short chocobo ride. So, this is cool because transmuter chips are new crafting stuff. They're essentially crafting recipes. Meaning that... And that's where they put it. No shit. That's where they put it. Um, I was wondering what was going to be over there. So, when I... When you do stuff... Uh, what's what's important about that? Well, I found this. It led to something else. The something else is now a a craftable. I don't know what it's going to be. It could be a weapon. It could be armor. It could be a quest thing. I don't know. Um, but it allows me to also level up my crafting, which is good, because the crafting levels lead to new actual new items, and not just like here's just more of high potions. No, no, no. It's like gear, actual gear that I'm looking for. So I'm like, oh, I, w I need to do this. I want to do this. And I've done effectively everything in the grasslands once I've done this. And here's the other part. The zones are gorgeous! Shit is beautiful! It's so pretty! If this is how The Witcher 3 is, then, you know, they they took it directly from it. If this is the thing that makes, like, The, w the Witcher and its stories and its side quests fun, and they seemingly did the exact same thing, where it's like, oh, meaningful side quests that actually have impact. Unlearth all the artifacts. What do you... Oh. Oh. You guys are already searching? They're already searching. It's funny that they look too. Even though I'm the one that has to dig it up. Then we get Chocobo Discovery music. That's one. High power wrist guards. Okay. Magical earrings and a bulletproof vest too. Okay, it's through this thing. So I just got the tier two accessories. Yeah, the fact that all the side quests have unique music really helps. Like really helps. Dude, what the hell? There it is. If that's a 10% strength boost, that's gonna be mad good. Enhanced Hunter's Bangle. Oh, really? Enhanced Armor. Okay. Yeah, they weren't kidding with these 400 tracks. Dude. Of course they were able to make 400 tracks. They just they just asked anybody, hey, you want to make music for Final Fantasy VII? And everybody comes running. Like it's like a New York marathon. Yes! Yes, 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 yes! I want to make music for FF7, holy shit! Camaraderie earrings? That's new? I don't know what the hell that is. All right. We did it! I didn't even mean to do it! And that's the crazy part. I didn't even mean to do this shit. I didn't even mean to do this. We just kept doing stuff. Didn't even mean to accomplish this whole thing. I want to know the story, bro. Like, I want to know. It's just like, I'm having a great time just doing shit. And yeah, I completely agree with everybody where they're like, Okay, so the side questing in, in FF7 Remake was really distracting. I agree. I just played through the game and did no side quests. No joke. I liked it more. I'm sorry. And yeah, I did no side quests. I liked it more. I legit enjoyed it much more without side questing. Um, this feels like all this stuff there. It feels like that was a direct complaint 
they were aware of it and now this is their answer and a lot of shit in this game is an answer to complaints of the first game which is legitimate the next game should feel like a true sequel it should enhance a whole bunch of stuff but it should also you know fix a bunch of problems the previous game might have had and yeah this side quests were a problem 100 percent um in environment diversity was a problem 100 percent some combat stuff was a problem 100 percent so it, they went ham dude they went seriously ham it's at the expense of some shitty looking assets every once in a while right obviously some shitty looking assets on poor unreal engine 4 but then you turn around and you look in any other direction it's like oh god it's beautiful it's just like remake dude you focus in really hard on any any specific element and it looks bad i i, I don't disagree with you you focus hard on one thing and it looks kind of bad but the picture as a whole is super nice is super nice so i i don't know like to me I'm, I'm kind of fine with the game like not being the most visually splendorful sort of thing although i I'm, I'm waiting for a pc version give me a pc version so we can eventually get that so what can i make now enhance hunter's bangle yes i can afford that um camaraderie earrings earrings crafted with magnetic metals to signify the bonds yeah but what does it do signify the bonds between comrades wait it's a bond increase so you wear it with somebody else and you work better together increased damage dealt with synergy skills and synergy abilities by 10 percent okay there's there's the actual information i'm looking for um high powered wrist guards Bro, okay, it's not 10%, it's 5% and 250 HP. Right. Right. Still very good. This kind of sucks. Spirit, 5% MP3. Jesus Christ, MP is hard to come by in this game. Um, I'm not going for a high percentage run. I That's not my plan. I have no plans for this playthrough. I don't know how fast I'm going to beat it. I have no plans. I'm letting, I'm just going with the game. I'm just going with the flow of the game. And the flow of remake was that, you know, I was going out of my way to do side quests. And this game, I, I was, I'm not. They're coming to me, you know? I'm not going out of my way to do side quests. They're just naturally coming to me. They're getting, they're, they are, they are in between me and getting cool shit. And I want to do cool shit. I want to get new stuff to do cool combat, you know? I'm sure, I mean, I'm sure people have played like a billion games like this before, but I'm really digging this one. It's pretty much it. All right, risk guards. Wait, I can upgrade clouds. Is that what you're telling me? Yeah. Yeah, this is just his. Take it, cloud. You get that. Um, The bulletproof vest. took those off Aerith. These are only 5 XP. Okay, they're not a lot. Because they're good. No, I want them. Red had the Crescent Moon Charm, which was what? This is a nice looking menu. Realize that. Um, reduces damage taken while not actively controlled in battle. That's cool. The Kupo Charm... Occasionally increases the amount of materials collected. That's nice. Max HP by 5%. Well, I don't know if I need that right now. Just because... You know. You know. Speed by 10. The friggin' music. God. Okay. Um. Okay. Grasslands dominated dominated the only thing left to do is to progress only thing left to do oh i still need to ass ass dude we're not done you're right son of a bitch chadley
I could go grab all of those auto casts. Son of a bitch, Chadley. Yeah, 100% intel isn't exactly 100% in the area. It's not. Hmm. I don't know. Not gonna worry about it right now, to be real. I'm not that, uh, worried about it. I'm gonna ass-ass the snake. How about that? So again... There's a small thing left to do in calm? Really? Wait, what? There is. What the heck is that? Tom is currently on high alert. Please limit your activities to essential. Hello there. Inspiring, isn't it? The view. I'm Snaps, by the way. Shutterbug and card carrying member of the Association of Photography Aficionados. Mind if I get a shot of you for posterity? <laughs> Pretty as a picture. You got what it takes to be in front of the camera. Commemorative but photo what frame? About behind it. So, apparently, there's a rather scenic spot not far from here. Thing is, this terrain's a bit perilous. At least for your average photog like me, but maybe not for you. If you find the spot, take a moment to appreciate it. Try to view it as a professional photographer might. Interesting. So even though, huh, even though we 100%ed the grasslands, that was the grasslands through Chadley? There's still things to fucking do? I also didn't even explore this area. How funny. Yeah, it's like FF15 photo missions. What? Chicken. Chicken. Chicken arise. Is it just right up here? When you stumble upon a particularly scenic location, Square on the main menu to enter photo mode. Just take a picture to capture majesty on film. Once you're satisfied with your shot, speak with Snaps again to be rewarded. Really? Really? Oh, they even, like, put a little icon up here. Huh. Main menu. Cloud, get out of the way. Cloud, get out of the way. Oh my god. I'm gonna throw up. I can hide the party. Huh.
Uh, do I take the picture with my PlayStation? Is that what it is? Oh, he just takes it. Huh. Do those get saved anywhere? It's just enter and exit photo mode. Ah. Ah. So if I wanted to set that up again. Hilarious. <sighs> Hilarious. Okay. Tom is currently on high alert. Please let me <laughs> Hey there. Thank you for tracking down that spot. Quite the view you captured. You did me a good turn, so I did you one too. I convinced the association to make you a member. Of course, you're starting on the bottom rung, but you'll work your way up. And the more locations you find, the faster you'll climb that ladder. You are now an amateur photographer. What the hell? What the hell? Huh. Well, there you go. Well, there you go. Chadley, I might as well make everything with you, right? You provided. It was as enriching as the lands you are beaconed. Indeed, it has been a valuable learning experience. One I could have never had in Midgar. I hope we can continue to study this world of ours together. And I might as well just make all of this autocast materia, right? Because it's not used on anything else. So about that combat simulator, right? About that. Assess 14 of 16 enemies in the grasslands. Shh. Jeez, dude, did I did I screw this up? I gotta find a rat and maybe the snake? The rat and the snake. A. Hey. A. Hey, wait a minute. Rat and the snake. Okay. Maybe I can actually bring the white wolf back. If there's anything else. I didn't I assess the white wolf, please. no. I did not, but maybe, just maybe. Hold up, hold up. Yeah, I already checked enemy intel. I did. Some rats out here. Where would I go to replay it? Would I just go back to the beach? We, uh... We tried to go and do it from the the sim, Al, and it didn't work. They have to be in the field. Did we already ruin our run? These stupid rats at. Dumb rats. They are. Okay. Oh, 
Oh my god, dude. Wildfire sets up for air combos. Yo, what? Wildfire sets up for air combos. Enemy skill leveled up. Okay. But Wildfire sets up for air combos? Um hold on. Combat settings. Clink. Oh man, I don't need Braver. Right. While in the air. I might actually take out Braver. Abilities, wildfire. Hell yeah. Bye, Braver. I'll pick, I'll just use it later when I need to. Um, so let's go to quests now and see if we can actually do this thing. Um, Livestock's Bane. Right? It's complete. Don't know. Hmm. 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 Huh. Uh, I guess the next best thing we can do is just go to the beach. Let's just go to the beach. Now you learn enemy skills by assessing in this one. Enemies don't have to use them anymore. Let's just go check this really fast. I'm pretty sure the snake would also count. 99% sure the snake also counts. But let's see if there's a retry to this fight. Oh, there's not. All right. Good to know. Good to know the wolf is not here. All right, snake it is. Right? You got a mission at the farm? What? No, I don't. Well, I mean, you mean I got the mission at the farm. I see what you mean. Maybe I can just talk to Oliver again? It's important to make sure they've got... Land won't last much longer if Shinra keeps doing no. what they do. No. All right. So our last hope is the snake. Hope is the snake. Um... Everyone's good on MP, everyone's good on HP. Looking gravy. Let's just use this anyway. Last hope is the snake. Yo, Phil's a her, thank you. It's important to make sure they've got plenty to eat. Pass down here. Here we go. Let's go fight a snack. Not to put ice material on everybody. Who do we want to use in this fight? Red. We got red Aerith Cloud right now. <clears throat> Right. You got fire and ice. Okay. See if I'll swap with you. Okay. 
Yeah, we haven't been fighting with Barrett a whole bunch. Let's um let's fight with Barrett in the in the next spot. Yeah. We'll fight with Barrett when we get to the Mithril Mines. So I have I did not beat the snake. No, I didn't have um when I was playing the this stuff from the the gameplay experience, I didn't have ice materia. Or have the character that had ice materia equipped. So it was crazy hard. And I, I didn't level up. I barely fought at all. All I did was run around and just like explore. And when I got to the snake, I like bum rushed it. And no joke. What's this? Huh. I bum rushed it and the snake whooped my ass. I got close to beating it, but it whooped my ass. How about that? I'm gonna be on this thing. Oh, five Mog Metals. Damn. Bruh. That's a lot. Yeah, this is legit. Well... Technically not the first boss. First boss after the tutorial. Right? We're progressing the story. I don't believe it. Over there. It's Sephiroth. <gasps> what? Come on. High caliber rifle. Barrett. What did you just get? Finally. Barrett gets a different gun. I don't see Sephiroth. Do you? No. I don't. High caliber rifle. Nice. Nice. Three additional weapon slot. <clears throat> uh, materia slot on the next level up as well. So what do you have on you? Max HP 200. Makes it harder to be interrupted while using overcharge. Increases overcharge reload when staggering enemies. That seems pretty good. Um, Yeah, that seems pretty fun. I'll take that. You're fine. True the swamp. Is that dry land I see? Let's go. Yeah, no. What the? Hey, get back here right now! Big snack. It disguised itself as an island. Gee, I had no focus. God damn. Here he comes. It's on you. I'm coming. Hey, I 
think this might be our chance. Be careful. This thing's already pissed off enough. Cloud bodyguard it. Busy? <laughs> No! It's your turn. <laughs> Lula, I got it. It's ass acid. An immerse an immense serpent that dwells in the swamplands. It strikes at any creature who enters its territory, pulling the newfound prey into its coils and then swallowing them whole. A potent venom drips from the base of its fangs, toxifying the waters in which it lives, inflicting enough damage. By exploiting its elemental weakness, we'll pressure it. Hitting it with synergy abilities, we'll pressure it instantly. God damn, bro. Go on. Don't overdo it. So it's my turn? You'll see. So, Blizzard. Okay. That's an instant. Get back! Damn, bro. Firework bladed in the face. Yeah. On it. Let's go. Damn. So that's what it's supposed to be. It's kind of hard to tell. And let's end this asshole. Shit. Oh, I'm doing Titan. Hell yeah. Get him. We ain't seen this yet. God of the Grasslands! Scorching breath! Oh god! Oh.
Boulder Hurl. I'm gonna, I'm saving it for that. Okay. Summon abilities. Boulder Hurl. Oh my god! We did it. And it was the last assess. We did it. Oh, this is bad. Cloud's dead. It's the end. All that chocobo stuff for nothing. Is this how Sephiroth did this? This is how they set that up. Oh, sh what? Wakey, wakey. Sephiroth needs him alive. Good to have you back, Cloud. <sighs> Sephiroth? I knew he was strong, but still. Those guys are looking for him, too. They've got to be. Yeah, I kind of get that feeling as well. Let's not lose her. Yo, Nuticon, thanks for the five gift subs. You can swim through the grass. I can swim through the swamp, like manually, if I wanted to. Like, we just go on a trip? Really? Well, that's interesting. Well, well, that's interesting. How oh, funny. Oh, there's a chest over here, though. Is there multiple chests over here? Damn. Am I being rewarded for my cunning ingenuity? I believe I am. Okay, well, it wasn't that much. Okay, well, it wasn't that much. Okay. There's some stuff in there. Swimming through a marsh. Uh, we take Barrett with us no matter what. We haven't fought enough with Barrett. 
That's what's gonna happen. Barra comes with us no matter what. In the mithril in the mithril mines at least. snake this is completely new to me yeah Shinra news today. 